All right. We are live now. Hopefully nothing will go wrong at all, technical-wise. Because if it does, you're going to hear a grown man cry tonight. Anyways. <laughs> Hello. Welcome one. Welcome all. To some uh, Digimon Survive. So, you know, after the whole shebang, that was Borderlands. Uh, I started doing the Star Wars stuff on the YouTubes. I'm also doing Breath of the Wild stuff on the YouTubes. And then Pokemon stuff on the YouTubes, right? So, I'm doing all that. And it's... It became... You know, it's a lot. It's a lot to do, right? And then... I pulled out my Steam Deck. I was like, it's been a while since I've really sat down with a visual novel. I'm going to play Digimon Survive. I heard good things about it. I heard it was a great visual novel. Yes, there's gameplay segments in this, but for the most part, I heard it was just a visual novel. Right? And then I played it for an hour on my Steam Deck. And I really liked it. I really enjoyed it. I was really liking it. A lot. And then I was like, wait a minute. Wait a minute. A part of me shouldn't do this, but then a part of me kind of has to. Because I'm enjoying it way too much. I gotta stream it. Now, I actually wanted to do Great Ace Attorney. I really did. And that was the mindset, right? It was, uh... It was, hey, I'm gonna play Digimon Survive on my own time, and then I'm gonna play Great Ace Attorney. I'm gonna stream that. But for some reason, I get this, like, nervousness. <laughs> with Great Ace Attorney, but with just Phoenix Wright in general, even though those uh, streams always, always do well, they always do well, and they are, they're always fun to do. But it's just a lot. It's like really a lot, and Digimon Survive is not right. It's just kind of, it's just really chill, right? And like a lot. So uh, I was, I was liking what I was playing. So I was like, yeah, no, this is the next stream. This is what's gonna happen, right? So we're gonna do Digimon Survive. And uh let's get started. <laughs> by the way, I'm late to my own stream by like an hour. <laughs> by an hour I'm late to my own stream. Mainly because uh I was just tired. I was just tired. So before we go in, let's just check the settings real quick, make sure I got everything the way I want it to be. Um, this game does have voice acting. It's all Japanese. It's not English. Um, and I, I'm gonna lower that because, you know, I'm, I'm gonna be reading it. It's a visual novel, so I'm gonna be reading it. And I kinda just don't wanna talk over the characters. But, man. Uh, I don't speak Japanese, so I don't know if it's good voice acting or not, but it sounds really fun. It sounds really fun. I, I, I really liked it. You know, characters have a lot of energy to them, and it's great. Um, they have a lot of energy to them without being Persona characters. That's the best way I can uh, describe them, right? Also, the soundtrack is ah beautiful. So, Digimon, you know, I've been around the block on Digimon a bit, but uh, for the most part, I'm not that in depth with knowledge. I gotta move my mouse to the side. What I really hate about this game, though, is if you're gonna play it on PC, um, your mouse cursor is locked to this game. <laughs> Even when you put borderless windows on, like, your mouse cursor is locked, so if I gotta do anything, I gotta fucking reach over to my keyboard and press, like, either shift tab or fucking, or, um, or the windows button. God, listen to that music. Can you tell that you're gonna get a story? <laughs> Alright. New game. Uh delete all autosave data. Yeah, I didn't even I didn't even use the cloud data that I had or whatever. So we're good. By the way, I, I wanna give big props to myself for uh <laughs> to myself because I'm awesome. For um the overlay that I put together. Hey man, that's a lot of characters to put in a small in a small space and I managed to do it. So hey. I'm giving myself props. That was that was really difficult to do. 
<laughs> that was really that was really difficult to do. All right, time for the most time for the most nerve-wracking part of any visual novel playthrough, and it's the reading. <laughs> it's the reading. Someone's gonna someone's gonna call me out. That's not how you say that word. Why you read so slow? I'm scared. What you scared for, little boy? Don't worry, we're okay. Come on over here. Oh no. They made it over here already? Did they? Gabumon, help me! Get away from there! I won't let you lay a hand on them. You guys! That kid gonna die. Two kids are gonna fucking die tonight. Oh, tips for attack oh, already? <laughs> okay. I'm all giggly right now. Time to learn some basics of battle. In battle, the order in which units, monsters, act is determined by their speed. Let's start with the movement. Press X to choose the movement command. By the way, if you're gonna play this on your Steam Deck, um, this game's kinda not really, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? It's not, um, optimized for Steam Deck 100% yet, so you would have to, like, go into the, the, controller layout and find like on the community tab someone has like a steam deck quick fix for it okay press x to move the area displayed on the grid represents the range of your character's movement you can rotate the camera okay so it's like the sky yeah? it's also important to switch over the camera to get full grasp of your situation now moving the blank square move to the blinking square on the grid you move with that or the cursor move your cursor to blank square on the grid press x got it now let's prepare to attack. Press X to choose the attack command. Here you will see information on skills you- Oh, that's very useful. <laughs> Shit. You got the range and the area of effect. Okay. This includes the skills effect, SP cost, range, and area. A skill range is- a, What? I, I had like a stroke already. <laughs> a, sk a skill's range is the distance it can reach, while its area refers to the size of its effect. Passive skills are special abilities that are always on. Pay attention to how each one works. First, let's see what happens with an ordinary attack. Attacking does not cost SP. Choose attack from the skill list and press X. When you select target, your estimate damage and accuracy will be displayed. Elemental affinities, critical hit chance, and more are shown, so pay close attention. Counterattack percentage is particularly important. This is a chance where enemy will fuck your shit up. Press the cursor on an enemy, uh, or a uh, L, and press X. Sweet. Handicap. Choose end turn to finish your turn. As you end your turn, you can face any direction. You take more damage if attacks from side or behind, so if you get flanked, you're fucked. Okay, so D&D rules. Got it. It's important to check up on other units in battle. Switch to the free cursor to get more info. Press circle to switch to the free cursor. You can move the free cursor anywhere on screen. Try putting it over an enemy. Hover the cursor over a unit to see the info displayed on the upper right. View more detailed information by pressing square in this state. That's odd. For some reason you can't see any information about this enemy. I don't know. It looks like a tadpole inside of an egg. There's nothing more to learn here, so press circle to stop displaying the information. Oh my god, that's a lot of fucking information, though. Holy shit. There's a lot you're telling me at once. That didn't reveal anything useful. <laughs> why, did I, why did I show you that? <laughs> Switch back to the regular cursor and just go all out. Press circle button. Get back to your menu. This is no ordinary foe. Aim for extra damage by attacking it from behind. Hit it and quit it, baby. Move to the blanking square behind the enemy. <clears throat> I shall do that. Go get him, Gobblemon. Use a skill for big damage, big money damage, big money moves. Each skill moves. Uh, each skill move has its own SP cost. Choose the attack command like before. Then select Blue Blaster from the skill menu. Okay. It's called Blue Blaster, but it's a fire attack. Move the cursor over to the enemy and press X. 
critical hit. You deal extra damage by performing a rear attack. Flank attacks also do more damage. He doesn't seem to have taken much damage. Is this enemy too powerful to defeat? Damn dog. I think we just pissed it off. Gabumon! Ugh, why I oughta. Whatever fuck name on your is. What is it? Rainamon? Something like that? Rainmon? All I know is just the Digimon that everybody wants to fuck, so... <laughs> no! I won't let you harm these children any- Wait, what? <laughs> these children? The Digimon? I won't let you harm these children any more than you already have. If we can just get to that place... Fucking run for it. Ugh. Miyuki? Miyuki? Mayuki. My bad. Mayuki! I'm okay. Go ahead for the light. Oh, shit. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Critical hit. Run, Haru. Get out of here. I'm not leaving you behind. What are you doing? Go on, hurry. It's no good. I can't hold them back anymore. Look out! What the... It's sucking me in! That's a fun thing to say. <laughs> uh, it's, if anything happened to you, I... You have to get back safe on your own. Somehow. What about you? Oh, someone's gonna die? Oh god! Oh god! I thought I was playing Digimon, not Corpse Party! Mayuki! I gotta save her, but how? Yeah, how? <laughs> she just got gripped up by the void. Damn, dog. I don't know if that's your friend or your sister, but she got fucked up. Wait for me. I'll rescue you, Mayuki. No matter what. Even if I have to become a murderer. Prologue. We did it. And so the game begins. What the fuck? <laughs> Sorry, my bad. That's my way of saying hi, just smacking you in the back of your shit. に
時間厳守で行動すること。てりえ。たくま。ああ、なんでもない。This is gonna be a fun game. <laughs> That's a tone setter. Whoa. Alright. Try my best not to talk during the cutscenes, but what the hell? Homeboy said, How's it going, guys? Smack the shit out of us. By the way, can you tell who the main character is? Is it the guy with the goggles? <laughs> so this is camp, huh? Pretty fucked up looking camp. I say camp, but we're holed up in an abandoned school in the mountains here. Why? Leave it to us to spend our school break going to another school. Not that this school is anything like the one we used to go to. Sup, Takuma? Today we're checking out the crusty old landmark. Sounds lame. Come on, don't say that, Minoru. Not like I disagree, but still. Hey, you two, don't talk like that. I told you we weren't here for fun and games. What do you mean we're not here for fun? Wait, what? It's camp. Yeah, yeah, so sorry, your highness. Again with that kind of talk? That knucklehead over there is Minoru, and the girl lecturing him is the Yo. Yo? Io? Yo? I think it's Yo. I think it's Io. That's how you pronounce it, right? I don't think it's pronounced A-O, <laughs> right? It's pronounced like uh, the girl from um, Danganronpa, right? I think it's E-O, right? I'm, I'm gonna say it's E-O. I didn't talk too much- oh uh, wait, what? I didn't talk to him much at school. E-O's cool. She came here from a different school, though. You don't know her? She doesn't go to the same school as us. <laughs> we gotta know each other here at camp, and that's mostly thanks to Minoru. The three of us ended up doing our extracurricular activities together. As you play the game, you will occasionally be asked to make choices. So, when I started playing this game, and I saw this fucking tutorial pop up, I went, Oh. Oh. Oh, I'm in for a treat, aren't I? <laughs> right? You will have two to four options to choose from. What? Okay. Your decision will affect your affinity with different characters and influence the story. Your affinity with other characters influences the battle backup they give during combat. With different results if you treat everyone equally as opposed to focusing on one person. You can check your affinities from the main menu, so I didn't even know that. I didn't even know that. Oh. <laughs> so don't forget to keep an eye on them. Yeah, but then, <laughs> not only there's an affinity system, but there's also like a karma system or something like that. Because there's a moment that's going to come up soon where you choose an option and then the game goes, goes, uh, what does it say? It says like your mood or your, or your, uh, your thought process has changed or something like that. And the moment I saw that, I went, what the fuck is this game? What is this? Anyways. I, you know, I haven't played that long in this game. You know, I only, again, I only went an hour in. Um, but I'm just going to play it the way I would, you know, the way I would work out any situation, right? I'm not going to go for any one specific character yet. <laughs> depends, depends on what we're working with. Okay, right? I'm pretty sure there's maybe a love interest or two. Um, because they did say they want to do more of a mature uh, Digimon story, not nitty and gritty, but more mature, like for the, you know, for the, not adults, but, you know, for a, for a, uh, 
older demographic. So, yo, what the fuck we doing, girl? What's today's route, yo? We're staring at the cherry blossom trees, right? Affinity up. Today we're going here, and then I think over here. And do you know why, Minato? Something about local legends or religion, right? <laughs> they said there's some weird shit going on. Not that it matters to me. I'm just here for shits and giggles. You're the only one I can rely on, Takuma. Keep an eye on him, would you? I'm not his fucking babysitter. Oh. <laughs> Even Takuma's like, I'm not his fucking babysitter? Oh, wow. What is it? Looks like Minara noticed something on his phone. Check it out. There's another story about a rock slide. That's several days in a row now. I hope it doesn't mean an earthquake's coming. Not just that, but look here. Isn't this close to where we're supposed to go today? Wait, really? I wonder if our plans for the day are still on. You can feel the tension in the air around here, so I must have shared the news. Alright everyone, can you tell who the bitch of the group is? <laughs> the fucking nerd. Alright everyone, calm down. Everyone, calm down down <laughs> like everyone's just chill and he's just screaming everything's gonna be just fine all the teachers gave clear instructions for dealing with any emergency shuji is an alumnus of out of i was about to say ios <laughs> of your school so he came to <laughs> ios <laughs> of your school so he came to chaperone the teachers and the chaperones are ensuring our safety, so there is nothing to worry about. We are not fellow students. Our destination is this historic landmark. So off we go. There he goes, at it again. That Shuji is too straight laced for his own good. Straight laced? The fuck are you? An old an old person? An oldie? Old head? Is that any way to talk to someone who's two years older than you? Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. Uh, right you are, my little yo. And don't I have to remind you, Minoru, that I'm actually in a grade above yours? And that matters because... I get we're Japanese, right? And we gotta be all respectful, but the, but and that matters because... Have you ever thought maybe because we're so respectful to one another that maybe that's why our birth rates are plummeting? And the countryside is fucked over there in Japan because no one's living there. Ain't no babies happening. The most horniest place in the world is also the most polite place in the world. So ain't no babies happening. <laughs> I mean, shouldn't you act like it then or something? You should be more of a nag like, I told you to nag it up. Does that sound like something I would say? Let's go before we get left behind, Takuma. Yeah, come on, Takuma. Let's hit it. I'm gonna have fun with these characters. I'm gonna have so much fun with these characters. Oh, look at the cherry trees. Oh, wow, the cherry blossoms are in full bloom. Everyone stopped on the way to the landmark to take in the flowers. Man, is this spring or is this spring, am I right? Right. Maybe the abundance of nature here brings out the beauty of these blossoms. It's not as beautiful as you. <laughs> Can we take a breather? I'm fucking tired. I'm glad we came here. It's cool. I'm glad we came here. Moral. That That's what it is. Fucking moral change. I saw that shit and I went, huh? My morale? <laughs> what? What's going on? I'm glad we came here on this camp. Makes me look forward to the historic landmark ahead. Indeed. I find myself brimming with all sorts of excitement. <laughs> if you put it that way, it sounds like we got some fun ahead of us. I feel like Minara is supposed to be like the Izzy of the group. <laughs> he just looks like Izzy. Remember Izzy? Oh, looks like Saki and Ryo beat us to the punch. They did go on ahead of us, after all. The guy shooting daggers at everyone is Ryo. An older kid from another school. Man, he's tall as fuck, dude. The girl who's all smiles there is Saki. Her looks are famous in the great below ours. 
So what you're saying is that the youngins are horny on main? Got it. <laughs> they must be here to enjoy the cherry blossoms too. I don't think he's enjoying it. Then again, I could be wrong in Rio's case. Wow, look how beautiful it is. The flowers are so pretty. Hmm. What kind of person gets all grumpy in front of a bunch of blooming cherry blossoms? But man, talk about a waste. Gorgeous weather, and we're doing extracurricular nonsense. What does one have to do with the other? Hmm, I thought as much. We're not in any real rush. Might as well look around here for some more. Alright. Gotta stop and smell the roses. As you play the game, you will be presented with choices of whether to go... Oh, wait, what? Of whether? <laughs> I added a whole word there. Choices of where to go or who to talk to. Use the L to move target. Try targeting one of the students along the tree lining path in the distance. Sure. You can also switch between targets with L1 and R1. Shoulder buttons. Try switching targets while you have one selected. I feel like this would be a great game to have on my Switch, but again, I have it on my, you know, I have it on my Steam Deck, so... <laughs> I still use my Switch. I have an OLED Switch, and it sucks. Dude, if I had an OLED Steam Deck, it'd be over. It'd be over. I would never touch my Switch. <laughs> Campers. Wait. Oh, I gotta press the button. There we go. Cool. Once you selected a target, press X to move to the next step. Who you talk to and what order may advance the story. You can target more than just characters, so keep an eye out for unexpected discoveries. Uh, I'm so tired. This camp is weak. Yeah, total weak sauce. <laughs> weak sauce. Oh, well, at least we get a few bars out of here. Wait, what? We get a few bars out here. Wait, what? <laughs> I got confused twice. Like, she said it, and I was like, you mean like, you mean like, like rapping? And then I read it again. I'm like, wait, you mean like drinking? But you're students. <laughs> we can kill a little time with that. For real, I can't even get a signal in the school building. Eh, man, what a hunk of junk you're looking around. I'm assuming we're teenagers, we're not like young adults, we're not like college kids. It'd be cool if we were college I hope we're college kids. <laughs> It'd be so fucking cool. College kids. Cherry tree, why does it say circle? Okay. Oh, it's not circle, it's the cursor. That's weird. That's a weird icon for that. Wait, how did I... There we go. Cherry tree lining the path are in full bloom. The gorgeous petals fluttering down. I'll let to sit here and just gaze at them for a while. Sounds like a plan. The stream. If I listen closely, I can hear the sound of babbling brook. You never hear something like this in the city. It's sort of comforting. Okay. Targets that lead to important story conversations will be marked with an exclamation point. So keep it in mind when you're deciding what to do next. Okay, so I'm going to talk to these two first. What's up, Minoto? Hey, Takuma. Did you know that the leaves of the cherry blossoms are poisonous? That's why you never see any weeds growing underneath them. That's cool. Uh, is that right? Wait, do people eat those sometimes? Well, sure, they're fine if you pickle them first. Huh. You sure should know some weird things, man. He's like, interesting, you're a fucking weirdo. Flowers are certainly beautiful in bloom. Not as beautiful as you! Yeah, that's... Yeah, that and the weather makes you want to sit down and take a load off for a while. Hmm, now that... Now that won't do. We gotta stick to our designated course. Aye, aye, ma'am. Alright, fucking Captain Buzzkill. Maybe I just want to take a break, alright? Can I talk to homeboy first? Nope. How's it hanging, Saki? Jeez, what crawled up your backside and died? Search me. Huh? <laughs> that's a... That's a... That's a response to that. Search me. He's like, why don't you get up in there and check yourself, girl? Let me guess. Suji and the teachers gave you flack for your cheerful disposition. You don't know what you're talking about. Sure, sure, whatever you say. Come on, it's time to go. Alright, already. 
<laughs> my man looks like he's getting dragged along. You were right over there. And anyway, how long do you plan on following me around? What do you expect? Who knows what you'll do if I take my eyes off you. So you're my supervisor now? Clearly, you're not the type to be left to your own devices. Oh, just shut up. I'm out of here. Fuck this. He runs away. Now, is that any way to talk to a cute girl like me? She's more cheerful than I thought she would be. I thought she would be like a gal girl, you know, just like kind of bitchy. <laughs> like they're both the delinquents, but but she's, she doesn't seem like a delinquent. Only he's the delinquent. Saki's headed for a landmark, chasing Ryo as he continues belly aching. I think, depending on who you talk first to first will affect the affinity, right? Let's, uh, let's actually do a test. I didn't... How do I... Stats? Is that what I want to do? Profile. Oh, shit. Okay. I have two affinity with Yo. Hmm. Okay. So let's test it out. I'm going to talk to Minato first. Those two get along way better than I figured they would. More like Saki can get along with anyone. That Ryo is a real pain too. She must be some kind of saint. Now, is that any way to speak about him? Yes. Directly about him, behind his back. All of us need to work together. I never heard anything come out of his mouth that wasn't a complaint or something. I can kind of relate, to be honest. It's like looking at how I used to be. Kind of embarrassing. You sure he's older? It's her past self? Is that something a middle schooler is supposed to say? Yo, you've been saying this a lot. <laughs> Everything that man said, you're like, is that something you should say? Is this something you should say? Why are you judging him? Judge yourself. Then again, I suppose an adolescent boy would say such things. Why are you talking like that? What? You're one year older than us. Taki, the exact opposite. The way she comes at you head on makes her seem more grown up. We only just meet... I can't even read. <laughs> we only just met here at camp, but she acted like we were best buds from square one. I think you resemble her in that regard, Minato. Yeah, he's the one who broke the ice with us after all. Indeed, head on as you would say. Ah, oh, jeez guys, knock it off with the compliments. My ego can only take so much. That wasn't a compliment. Huh? <laughs> what? How is that not a compliment? Wait, what happened? <laughs> Wait. It's, explain yourself. Ma'am, is it? Finally, some good manners. What? Did I miss something? What happened? Wait, who said ma'am? Wait, what? Is there a log button? Hold up. Wait, I'll find it. Here we go. Huh? Are you okay, yo? Oh, uh, sure. That's what I was going for. Wait, what? Huh? What just happened? Man, I wish she'd back off a bit, you know? Read the room a little, so to speak. I suppose it depends on how you look at it. She can be outspoken at times, to be sure. But she's also cheerful, cute, and quite uh, ambi-capable. Ambi-capable? Wait. wait. Am ambi-capable. Am yeah, no, wait, what? I what is that word? Fuck. <laughs> I don't know that word. You're using big words for me. The sort of honesty you sense from her, I quite like it. Wow, where did all that come from? She just seems a bit radiant, don't you think? Uh, I see. Still, she goes a bit overboard. A big sister like me has to look out for her. Big sis is always watching. Would you look at those flowers? How wonderful. Hey, did you know, yo? They said there's a dead body under every cherry blossom. I don't want to hear about that shit. <laughs> Get that shit out of here. You okay, man? I'd rather we head towards the historic landmark if we could. You really want to stay here talking about, wow, the flowers. Everyone went this way. Looks pretty rocky up the path, huh? What a pain. So what, we got left behind? Alright. Time to fucking trot along. It was a normal conversation on a normal day with friends. Well, normal other than the camping part. 
what's not normal about camping? <laughs> you know, unless you get mauled by a bear. At least, that's what I thought. That was your first problem. You thought. <laughs> we cleared the tree line path. Uh, we headed up the trail. Wait, what? Oh, I skipped the whole word. We cleared the tree line path and we headed up the trail. Huh? Look at that. Huh? What the hell's the police doing here? Oh no, it looks like the road is blocked off from here. You're right. There's a lot of tape that says, keep the fuck out. Don't go stepping over here, no no, dead body. Hmm, maybe it's related to the rock slide Minara was talking about. Why are you saying his name like he's not in front of you? <laughs> what? You're talking to him right now. Oh man, did I call it or did I call it? Just find my ass, Takuma. Oh dear, I suppose it's a problem. There's only one path to the landmark. They're here. Why don't you just go around? <laughs> the landmark? What was its deal again? This is why I told you to review the site the, uh, the site of the ritual related to the Kinomon- What the fuck? A fuck what? <laughs> the Kimonogami? Those Kimonogami things don't really ring a bell. You mean the beast gods? Uh, nothing we can do about it. Our only option is to head back for now. We come all this way, might as well get the lowdown on what the hell happened here. Let's see what the people gathered in front of the police car have to say. Whoop, whoop, that's the sound of the beast. Whoop, whoop, that's the sound of the police. Maybe I should ask the police officer what's going on here. Whoop, whoop. Seeing it with my own eyes, it's more impressive than I imagined. Pretty cool. It's not like I wanted to become a cop, but I like to try riding in, in one sometime. You like to try riding it? Even if I gotta get arrested. Uh, what's the button again? Did that affect my affinity? Oh no, okay. I guess it's only choices that affect your affinity. Alright, Minaro, how's it hanging? Hmm, think there was an accident or something? Let's ask around. So many people. What could have happened? Alright. Well, I kind of want to investigate a little bit. There's a sign back here. The closed road sign set up here by the police doesn't offer any detail. The people around there, uh, people around here say that a landslide happened up the road. Okay, anything else? Old sign. The letters are so faded, I can't make out what the sign is supposed to say. Must be really old. Must be really rusty, crusty, dusty, musty. Hold up, what? You're saying there was an accident? Dang, man. I ain't never seen some shit like that before. What do you think? Should we just bust on... Wait, what? Oh. <laughs> Should we just bust on out of here? <laughs> Grab a video for some views? Whoa, whoa, hold up, man. They get pissed at us for sure. They would get pissed at us for sure. But, uh, I ain't trying to become the next Logan Paul, alright? Taking videos in a fucking forest. What's his face? Shuji? Said he'd go and ask the teachers about it, you know? Okay. Uh, what the hell do these people gotta say? Woman. Oh, dearie me. Wait, gray hair lady? That's a lady? <laughs> I thought that was an old man. I can't tend to my fields if I can't get through. The landslide, how frightful. Nothing but strange things happening around these parts. You got that right. If this keeps up, all the old timers are gonna start blaming it on monsters. Now, now, don't go saying such things in front of the children. Think about the children! Alright, officer, what the hell's going on out here? Excuse me, did something happen here? Yeah, man, I uh, found a dead body. <laughs> There's a landslide up ahead around dawn, so the road's been sealed off. Oh, it must have been the one we read about online earlier. Okay. Well, that solved that. Oh dear. We can't proceed with things like this. Yeesh. So much for exploring the great outdoors. Guess camp is cancelled. Time to go inside and play some fucking video games. I don't know about all that. Still, perhaps we should turn back for now. Alright. I'm out of here. Um. Right? Oh, I gotta talk to me now, 
A landslide? For reals? <laughs> For real? Where's Ryuji when you need him? For real? Man. Thank the guys that went ahead are okay? Wait, they went ahead and then within like two seconds a landslide happened? No childish jabes? Jabes? Jabs? Jeeves? Axe Jeeves? I suppose you wouldn't be so callous as to joke at a time like this. I would be. Those motherfuckers are dead. Of course, even I know when to watch my mouth. Sometimes. Maybe. <laughs> He's like, maybe. Okay. Well. Anybody else to talk to? Oh. The, uh, okay. The area ahead is off limits. Yeah, I already knew that. Okay, great. <laughs> Seems that we can't go through. What's the plan? Should we head back for now? No way! Don't talk out of your ass, or you'll regret it. Huh? Who's getting beat up? <laughs> I can hear someone kicking up a fuss, or getting their ass kicked. Hey, look, that's Ryo and Saki over there. Oh god, what's going on here? I knew they went ahead. I guess they took the long way around. More importantly, who's that girl, I wonder? Okay, you listening? These rock slides are retribution from the Kimonogami. Huh? Retribution? In this day and age? Give me a break. Yes. When disrespected outside- wait, what? Disrespected. When disrespectful outsiders cause trouble on the mountains, they get real mad. This holy mountain is the ki kimono. The kimono. What the fuck? The ki. Oh shit! <laughs> I'm having a stroke just looking at the word. Okay, the ki minorium. All right, that's a word. A sacred shrine to the kimonogami. This is no place for someone to just wander around. The hell is a kim kinomorium? What the fuck? I bet it's some weird ass rock or bear carving. <laughs> they worship that stuff in the boonies. My oh man, Rio, you look like you just came out of the boonies. <laughs> Chill out, Rio. She's just a kid. You don't have to go. S you don't have to be so nasty with her. <laughs> nasty? I was just all right. Hmm. <laughs> the boonies, you say? How rude. This is the site of a glorious shrine. Not some new imitation, but a historic legendary shrine known by no only to the locals. A shrine? You mean like the one supposed to have ancient gods? I like a little hiccup. I need a drink of water, holy shit. I'm dying! All this reading is making me thirsty. I also just remembered that doing visual novels for streams are killer on your throat. It's fucking... it's really hard. I know like after every goddamn Phoenix Wright uh, stream that I did, I just wanted to die. I couldn't speak. <laughs> I've read about those before. Gods of the Harvest or Fertility, things like that. Saki, I would pray to any god with fertility with you. Giving me some fuck me eyes. Nah, this is different. These are ancient beast gods, known only to the locals. I've known all about these gods ever since I came here. Sounds like a fairy tale to me. It isn't. They're real. What's your name, kid? It's Mew. What's yours? I'm Saki, and this guy with the toot is Ryo. So, Mew, do you think you can take us to this hidden shrine you're talking about? Take you? Yeah, I guess so. Curious, huh? You don't really believe in this stuff, do you? I'm telling you it's real. Why not? Our trip's been cancelled. It's not like we ain't got anything better to do. All we have is waiting for all we have waiting for us at camp is a bunch of work, right? And you hate that shit. Are you seriously telling me you wanna go and work? I still I still say it's stupid. It's not stupid. Oh god, she's gonna claw your fucking eyes out. Yeah, yeah, whatever you say, kid. It's not kid, it's Mew. Her name's Mew, and she's wearing cat ears. <laughs> A little on the nose, you think? 
Well, lead the way, Mew. I'm not gonna be happy if you're messing with us, got it? I'm gonna kick your ass. <laughs> well, I guess they're off for some extra credit somewhere. The Who the fuck needs extra credit in a camp? That's Saki for you. Something tells me they're not up to anything so commendable. They don't even know what kind of template it is. Template? Why did I say that? What kind of temple it is? Do they? Entry may be prohibited. Never heard of it, yo? Hmm, I don't see anything like it on the map. Could there really be a hidden shrine? Or is it just some kid's imagination? What do you think, Takuma? What do I think? I think, uh... Fucking... Let's have some fun! Yeah! Sounds like a good time. Let's follow them. Yeah. Now that's what I'm talking about. I want to see a ghost. Oh, great. Just what we needed. The Shrine of the, Kinomo <laughs> the, Shrine of the Kimonogami sounds fun. Can we go with you? Sure, the more the merrier. Thanks. Nice to meet you. You too. Sounds like we got a couple of eavesdroppers. Why don't you and your merry band of bozos go back to the school trip? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry that I don't trust you going out and I don't trust you, of all people, going out into the woods with a young woman and a little child. <laughs> you look like you're going to stab him for fun. Let's get a move on, Mew. Wait, so we can't go? Come on, don't be like that. Jeez, Ryo, that attitude of yours needs some work. And she's going to work you hard to the bone, Ryo. Saki, you can work me any day. <laughs> Sorry about that, you guys. Wait, so I can't go? Ryo and Mew, wait up. There they go again. For now, we better wait here for someone to tell us where to go next. <laughs> for now, I better wait here for my next main objective. That or head back to the school. Gotta admit, that sounds like a pain. More importantly, we got no idea what might happen. We should chase after those three. Then why did we just stand still and do not do anything? What? Yeah, let's follow them. I'm really hungry. <laughs> I just randomly got hungry. Oh man, talk about bad timing. Oh, I'm really hungry. Damn it! Pursuing Saki, Ryo, and that little kid Mew, we ended up in a tunnel. Well, at a tunnel. Not a soul to be seen around us. But I hope there's a ghost. And no other paths. Did they head through here? Look, it's dark. Wait, look, it's... Wait, what? what? Look at this dark... Okay. Wow. Alright, Minaru. <laughs> Give me a moment here. Look at this dark, creepy little murder tunnel. You know what? I would definitely say some shit like that. I'd be like, man, it looks like a bunch of murder in here. <laughs> Tell me about it. Does it feel colder around here? Oh, God, I'm so hungry. My stomach is attacking the hell out of me. I've had, like, a very fun week in which my stomach hurt so bad that I had to go to the ER. And then they made me feel better after, like, six hours. <laughs> and then after that, I just had, like, this endless feeling of hunger. I'm like so fucking hungry right now. Tell me about it. Does it feel colder around here to you? It makes my skin crawl. There's some spooky shit going on around here. Would you do refrain from such absurd talk? It's scary as fuck. I bet one of those ghost hunters... I want to see a ghost. I bet one of those ghost hunter shows would get a kick out of this place. Is refrain not in your vocabulary? I said fucking stop it. I don't see them here. Maybe we should forge on ahead? What the fuck are you, a samurai? <laughs> Why are you talking like that, yo? Maybe we should forge on ahead. Hey, you there. Oh, look. So we got a guest. Oh, shit. It's the fucking narc. Shuji, is that you? You can't. Why do you keep talking like that, Shuji? You can't just run off on your own. We have enough trouble with the landslide as is. Excuse me? What? <laughs> Excuse me? Your bluster ship? Besides, we think Saki and Ryo went this way. Oh, for the... 
The guy's had to learn to act his own age already. I have his and Saki's numbers in the student phone book. I'll try giving them a call. You think they're gonna answer you, you fucking narc? Of course Ryo's not gonna answer you, and I'm pretty sure Saki trying to find any excuse she can to suck his dick. Oh my god, my stomach- oh, I don't know if the mic is picking that up, but it is- it is a loud growling noise, and I feel every inch of it. Oh my god. <laughs> Fucking Christ. Oh. I got two more hours of the stream. I can go for four hours, but let's we'll see what happens. If I'm really, really that hungry, we'll, we'll stop it at three hours. He's been letting it ring for a while now. I guess Saki hasn't noticed it yet. Say, what do you think those kimonogami deal? Wait, what? Do you think those kimonogami deals? The wait, what the fuck? What are you saying? <laughs> what do you think those kimono? Fuck, I can't even read no more. Kimonogami deals the girl was talking about are like what? <laughs> That's a weird way to say that. Who knows? Some kind of animal, I guess. Minaru, you didn't hear a single word of lecture on today's landmark, did you? Their gods taken the shape of beasts, the land of which was passed down in this area. That kid said only the locals know them, so I bet this land has some unique characters. Characters? Why'd I say that? Creatures. So they became gods and started handing out retributions like hotcakes? You get smited! And you get smited! It's just Keanu Reeves, like in the cyberpunk thing, where he's like, You're breathtaking, but now he's like, You're getting smited. <laughs> Imagine Keanu Reeves just smiting everybody left and right. That'd be awesome. Give me a break. People used to attribute the unknown to the gods, giving offerings to prevent disaster. Most people don't come around here these days. I imagine only locals come to visit. That's the way the cookie crumbles, I guess. No good. Seems neither Saki nor Ryo have a signal where they're at. Or they're just fucking ignoring you. You narc ass. Hmm. Guess it'd be weird if their phones worked in the middle of nowhere like this. You're sure they came this way? Well, yeah, quite certain. Almost certain. We didn't really see them go this way, but you know. And around here, that's for sure. Maybe the shrine is up ahead. It isn't on our map, so we're not sure where to look. Alright, we'll have to track those two down and head back to the school ASAP. They're past this tunnel. Let's go. Hey, at least he's not a coward. I should talk with the others about what to do next to search for Saki and the others. Okay. Yo, how you holding up, girl? You say you was all scared and shit. You good? Hmm. Are we really going to the tunnel? I don't see any other way. Unless I just turn around and go home. <laughs> this is our only option, right? Yeah, but... You're not afraid of the dark, are you? Just a bit. Creeps me out a little bit. You know what? I appreciate the honesty. Hey, why are we talking about this? We gotta go bring Saki and the others back right away. Okay. Minaru? Minaru's out here, he's like, yo, I wanna see a fucking ghost. <laughs> I'm ready to die tonight. What are your plans? Boy, just when I thought I was gonna die of boredom, things getting interesting, huh? Are you just gonna join the search? Who cares about that? Let those fuckers let those fuckers die. This tunnel now. A lost shrine. I smell adventure, don't you? Uh I see what you mean. Right? Might as well look for some ruins while we look for those jokers. <laughs> ruins? I think the joke might be on you. Alright, Narcass, what do you got? You know, you should have stopped them from going in the first place. <laughs> I was about to say that I did try and stop him, but I didn't. I tried to actually go with them. I encouraged them. I said, yeah, that sounds fun. Let's go. Well, we kind of tried. They weren't in any mood to listen. Ah, I see. Well, nothing to be done about it. Guess he'll, I guess I'll help pursue them next time. No worries. Okay. Oh, man. My stomach is really kicking my ass. Holy shit. Come on, let's go bring back Ryo and Saki together. That being said, which way should we go? Huh? Who's coming this way? Ugh. 
it's a it's a new character and he brought snacks <laughs> and then i start like opening a candy bar and just eating it on stream i wish i had do i have any snacks in here i got some cereal behind me but like oh i got some ice cream in my freezer hold up wait a minute give me a second give me a second give me a second i'm gonna go hold up hold up i'll be right back <laughs> give me some ice cream I'm back. I got a mini fridge in my room. I got some pistachio ice cream in it. But the ice cream is kind of like really soft. It hasn't firmed up the way I want to, so I got to put it in the big freezer. I'll do that later though. Alright, back to my screen in my system. I hit the fucking spot. Oh my god. I felt that shit right away. Holy shit. I didn't try to get too much ice cream, but I'm gonna have to finish this shit. Excuse me. I'll leave from that camp, right? I live around here. I'm just looking for my sister. I mean some ice cream too. You want some? <laughs> Your sister? Yeah, she's a bit frail, but she likes to go off on her own. My sister is, uh... How do you put this? Like a tiny animal? Timid and needs protecting? <laughs> My sister's like, uh, how do you put this? She's like a, she's like a rat. <laughs> I need to protect her. Are we talking about the same girl? There was a kid hanging around here named Mew, but she doesn't fit that bill. Mew? Did you just say Mew? Yeah, I sure did. Yeah, we met a girl named Mew. Maybe grade school age, wearing a hat with cat ears. Yeah, that's her. You seen her? Say what? Girl we met had had wait what? Say what? The girl we met had a few more screws loose than the girl you're describing. Hey, don't be rude. I'm just saying I didn't see any shrinking violet who needed saving, that's all. Who gives a fuck what you think? <laughs> just tell me where she's at. Well, I'm sorry, but we're actually looking for her ourselves. She went off to go into a shrine with some of the other campers. We're just getting we're just going to try and bring them back with us. I'm trying to read, but I also really want to eat this ice cream. I see. So she went on her own. Thanks so very much. And after I told her not to go alone, huh? Give me a second, Kaido. I gotta eat this ice cream. Can't let it melt. It's pistachio, man. I fucking love pistachio. My name's Kaido. If you want, we can go look for them together. Why not? We're all after the same thing, plus you know where the place is, right? <laughs> sure, I'll show you the way. Why did he laugh? <laughs> He's like, yeah, I know where the place is. That's where I do all my murders. I'm gonna kill all three of you right now. My bad, four of you. I forgot the other guy was here. <laughs> I wasn't raised here, but I lived here for a long time. I know the shrine is... Wait, what? Oh, I know where the shrine is. Come on, follow me. I'm Minaru, that's Takuma, and this here is Yo. Forget about the other guy, he's a lame ass. 
and I'm the leadership weird the what? <laughs> Hold up, you're the what now? Excuse me, motherfucker. You're the one with the glasses. You're not the one with the goggles. I'm the leader. From the looks of him, I thought Kaito was an adult. He's the same age as me. I'm relieved, though. He looks like we can count on him. We'll get there in no time. Hmm? Say, guys, it's spring now, right? Does a bear poop in the woods? If it's not spring, then when is it? I just figure we're a little too far south for it to snow all of a sudden. What the hell are you... Huh? You're right. There is snow. Like the first Dijon, uh, Dijon? What the hell's wrong with me? I mix the word, I mix the word, uh, season and, Dig and Digimon, so I got Dijon. Like the first season of Digimon, it starts snowing. Calling this unseasonal would be a bit of an understatement. Yeah, I'm not sure about that, Takuma. I remember, uh, I remember one summer over here started, like, hailing for, like, four hours. It was like big sides of golf balls, like you just randomly started hailing, so. Indeed. It snowed here last week, too. I heard the weather gets all wonky around these parts. I heard I heard of similar stories in other places. Yeah, like Texas. God forbid they get any snow. <laughs> Fucking Christ, they don't know what to do. Half of them die. Whoa, some kind of blizzards kicked up here, yeah? So cold. I'm so cold. It's too dangerous to keep going. I'll go take a look, so why don't you all go back? Why don't we duck back into the tunnel? Who knows what happened before we make it back? Yeah, you're basically just telling us, like, you're like, I'll go in the tunnel for shelter. You guys go fucking brave the storm back home. Fair enough. It might not be indoors, but it's better than sitting out here. That's true. Alright, let's retreat to the tunnel for now. Yeah, our fearless leader. Listen to what I gotta say. Give me a second, Minara. I'm eating ice cream. Fuck off. I'm almost done, alright? I'm trying to eat as much as I can, but I don't want to get brain freeze. ice cream has like little bits of pistachio in it so I'm still kind of chewing that's right I said it I got nuts in my mouth <laughs> Saki and the others came through here huh it's getting colder and colder you're shaking oh shit how you doing girl harmony change harmony wait what <laughs> harmony wait a minute what <laughs> what the fuck does that mean? I just want to see she's alright. She's out here shaking. You alright, yo? You don't look so good. Hmm, I'm fine. Must be the snow. I feel like it's worse in here than out there. I imagine they just run on if Mew was with them. She's used to this place. It's getting dark, and the footing isn't great here. Let's go, but watch your step. pitch black. I can only see in front of me. <laughs> still isn't, uh, still isn't, wow, I can't read. Still isn't this some kind of ex expedition? I'm getting kind of pumped. Hey, this is no time to be playing around. It's not safe for us to keep going like this. 
but if we use the camera light... Whoa! Ah! Uh, knock it off, Minoru! Don't just scream like that. Even I got spooked. My bad, man. I just saw this shit. There's some Blair Witch Project shit going up in here. <laughs> ah, is this a secret? Is this secret rope? Why would something like this be doing here? Wait, what? Did I read that right? What would something like this be doing here? Hmm. Maybe it's where the kingdom of kin. Oh, fuck! God damn it! That word. The kimonogami are enshrined or something. Now that I think about it, you mentioned that you weren't allowed to enter here, right? Yeah. The village believes it in retribution. Kids are warned to stay out. What? What's this wind coming from? The tunnel entrance? Ah, oh, jeez. Must be one hell of a storm out there. You think those three are in trouble? We better hurry on to the shrine. Yep. Yeah, you're right. Come on, there's no time to lose. Yeah, you scaredy cats. Just walk through the tunnel and end up in another world, like every other anime. My dog is making noise in his sleep right behind me. He's moaning in his sleep. The snowfall. Uh, the, the, wow, I couldn't read. Snowfall. <laughs> the snowfall is slowing down. Wait, what the? What the hell happened to the blizzard? This tunnel isn't that long. What could have happened here? <laughs> Talk about lucky. Just up and stopped on us, huh? More like it didn't snow on this side at all. Look at all these creepy ass flowers. Looking like the ending to Iyu Yasha out here. <laughs> Look at all these flowers. Ain't there something uh ain't they something else? Of course it's a sea of red. I feel like I've seen them in our field guy, maybe. If memory serves, these are called red spider lilies. Right, that's what they are. But this isn't right, it's spring and... Yes, they bloom in autumn. Yeah, you could, uh, you can, you can meet the conditions out here, it'll, it'll be fine, not that bad. What in the world is going on here? Hmm, I gotta figure something out. Should we check out this area a little more before heading to the shrine? Yeah, I guess, why not? What a suspicious looking forest. I should look around, or maybe talk with the others. Where's a uh, homeboy? Well, I guess I can't talk to him. That would be my first reaction to be like, yo, hey. Uh, what the hell is this place? Well, I guess I talked to Yo for- I wouldn't talk to fucking Shuji first. I'll talk to Yo. I'm like, girl, you alright? You still got that bad feeling? <laughs> this area. I got a bad feeling about something- something ain't right. Not right. How? I'm sorry, I just can't quite put it into words. I can. Shit's fucking scary, man. I don't feel right. We gotta get the fuck out of here. <laughs> I can put it exactly into words. Take the flowers. They should be pretty, but they give off. They give off. Uh, I can't read. <laughs> they should be pretty, but they gave me the creeps more than anything. All right. What about you, Shuji? Shujin? Shujin? Academy? What's good? Abnormal weather occurs in this area. Maybe it was a localized snowstorm? First I've heard of something. First time I've heard of something like that. That blizzard. Well, I can't read. Fuck, damn it. <laughs> that blizzard was no joke. I had ice cream and then my brain went stupid. Isn't sugar supposed to make you smarter? Hmm. Then there are these red spider lilies which only bloom in the fall. I'm telling you guys, spring is in the air. What the hell? <laughs> it's like, what the hell are you talking about? Shut up. <laughs> okay, I guess I talked to Minato then? Oh wait, I forgot. I can check the areas out. Spider lilies. Here we go. What's this? There's a bunch of stuff floating in the air. I think it's those, whatchamacallits? Spores? Ain't no fucking spores I've ever seen. I never heard of a red spider lady doing something like that. These things aren't bad for us, are they? But, alright, calm down. Calm down, dude. It's not the fucking happening. Alright? <laughs> it's not the happening where the plants are killing us. Flowers like these can be found anywhere. I mean, they look pretty normal. Yeah, says the guy that has the stare of a fucking murderer. 
The guy with, with no soul in his eyes. These look pretty normal to me. Come on, let's hustle. The snow should be on us soon. Let's get to the shrine. Yeah, you're right. Lead the way. They don't seem to be anywhere around here. The shrine must be further in. The shrine must just be ahead. We should head towards it for now. This is... Kaito said people never come here, but this is breathtaking. It's also kind of eerie. How could anyone expect visitors to come to a shrine all the way out here? They didn't. In fact, they made, us, uh, they made sure to warn anyone about it. That's strange. I don't see the... I don't see the... Uh, wow, I can't read. I lost all ability to read. I don't know what the fuck happened to my brain, but I just lost it. <laughs> That's strange. I don't see the others anywhere. I could have sworn I saw someone just now. Now, where could they be? You shouldn't be saying that shit like that. This creepy ass place. You're like, I could have sworn I saw someone over. Huh. <laughs> we should all look around and see what we can find. Alright, but stay close, guys, alright? I don't want. I don't want nobody getting killed. <laughs> should I look around here? Okay. Again, can't talk to me not can't talk to nobody, okay. We're, we're, got the shrine. That's it. Huh. Okay. Just the shrine. The shrine. Nothing looks out of place here. My man's out here taking pictures before he dies. Check out this place. There's crazy patterns all over it. And I was snapping tons of photos on his phone. Huh, didn't know he was into that shit. I know he was into that freaky shit. I bet they got some freaky ass demon statues stood away in here or something. I don't know about that, but whatever they worship here, it ain't normal, that's for sure. It's kind of a... <laughs> that's kind of one way of putting it. What's this? Some sort of animal? A bird? Wait, a reptile? You can just say lizard. You can just say lizard. You didn't have to say reptile. You didn't have to go to a whole fucking genus. <laughs> like, <laughs> There's patterns of various animals all over, but I don't recognize any of them. Oh, what's this? A lion? A dog? Wait, a lion dog. A Snoop Lion. <laughs> Call me Snoop Lion. That's my new name. <laughs> Remember that? Remember when Snoop Dogg wanted to be called Snoop Lion? And you saw how that turned out? Now he's out here doing the bootleg people's elbow? <laughs> Man, I just eat this shit up! Damn it, Minoru! Now's not the time to take pictures. I don't know, I would say now's the perfect time to take pictures. We're gonna die. <laughs> Might as well have a f something with evidence on it. Choosy's right. We have to look for Saki and the others. I love how... <laughs> I love how when everyone's talking about them, the first the first name that comes out of their mouth is Saki. They're like, I don't give a fuck about that kid, and I don't give a fuck about Ryo's bitch ass either. Still, this place is so weird. I'm not surprised Minari wants a few mementos. And then you give him, and then you give him a Blu-ray of Memento. It, it's a joke. All right, let him have his fun. Enough photos. Take more over here. I, mm, I would, in my mindset, I would be like, hey, go ahead, keep taking photos. I need to know that at least we got some evidence if I die, right? But I think this is more like, like, oh, yeah, man, take photos. Nah, but for me, it's more like, okay, take photos, all right? But, but like, you know, yeah, enough photos, I guess. Yeah, enough photos, enough photos. Harmony changed. What the fuck does that mean? What does that mean? You got, you got harmony, you got morale, and you got affinity. Does that mean he don't like me no more? If I check, if I check my profile, does he hate me now? No, we're still good. <laughs> we're still good. Right. Let's find them as fast as we can. I'm sure this place is making them uneasy. 
All right, already. Come on already. We gotta find them and fast. Right, sorry. Okay, let's go. <laughs> He's fucking panicking about his sister and we're out here fucking around. Wow, this shrine really does worship beasts. There are places like this all over Japan. Some worship octopuses. O octopuses? O octopi? Octopus? Octopussy? <laughs> you knew I was gonna say it. You knew it was coming. I was thinking it. You were thinking about it. We all were thinking it. I just had the I just had the goal to say it. Or weird ass trees. The ones that worship the loot stuff are the best. My man said I am into that kinky shit. Hey, watch your mouth. There's a girl here. Meanwhile, Shuji has like the biggest boner ever. <laughs> it's like, whoa, you're pinching a tent, my guy. Minaru. Okay, yo, I'm sorry. I wonder, is this place passed down in the legends? Wait, what? Huh? Is the is this the place? Okay, is this the place passed down in the legends we were supposed to visit today? Legend, who knows? What do you mean, who knows? You live here! As I said, I was told not to set foot in here. I don't know much about it. But the locals say people get spirited away up here. What the fuck? You should have said that first. <laughs> you didn't say that before. You said, oh yeah, the shrine's this way, follow me. You didn't say people getting got out here. What the fuck are we doing here? Your sister's dead. Let's go. <laughs> I see. That's certainly frightening. What the fuck is that? What the hell was that? I ain't never heard anything like that before. Just just the fucking trees creaking in the wind or something. Who gives a damn? Let's go. Hey guys, don't stray too far, okay? <laughs> Me we're having we're having a moment over here. Meanwhile, Shuji's in the background. He's like, hey guys, guys, I'm the leader. Listen to me. Do you guys hear me? I'm the leader. <laughs> the blizzard might not be the only thing we have to worry about. Let's go look for clues. Exploration. Okay. What's up, spy? How's it going? <laughs> oh my god, Dusty. Uh, is this a game from the very popular Digimon Digital Monster franchise? Actually, fun thing about this game, this game was in development hell for like, I want to say four years maybe? Um, I don't know too much about Digimon. I only know like the early stuff for the most part and like a couple things here and there. But um uh and I played a little bit of the Cyber, uh, Cyber Sleuth games, but they're kind of just like generic RPGs. They're not really that 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 impressive. They're they're cool though, I guess. But um yeah, this game had like had like really bad like delays and shit to the point where they had to remake the whole entire game because the um development got shipped over to a different team and like fucking uh the team that they gave the development to they're like here's all the work we did and they were like fucking they're like yeah that's cool uh we don't know how to work with this engine that you gave us so we just have to redo everything you did <laughs> so it delayed the game for like another two years and then COVID happened, and then this game came out around the time of Xenoblade Chronicles 3. It came out right between Xenoblade Chronicles 3 and fucking the Live Alive remake on Switch. And I think this game was coming out on Switch at first, and it got ports later. I don't know if this game... I think this game did decent... To, oh yeah, it also got review bombed by all the people who hated it. Because uh, all the Digimon fans were excited for it. And all the trailers and stuff was like, this is a visual novel with a little bit of battles in it. And then apparently people got mad that they bought a visual novel, even though, even though they told them it was a visual novel. <laughs> so then it got review bombed. But I think it still sold okay, but not as well as the uh, Cyber Sleuth series. Fucking Cyber Sleuth series did like, what, like 2.4 million sales or something like that. And it's still making money. It's crazy. People who can't read out here hating visual novels. Uh, even more <laughs> iconic too. Definitely. Definitely. But yeah, the development of this game is interesting as fuck. But yeah, I, I played this game earlier, you know, earlier this week. 
because you know I did the Borderlands stuff and and right now I'm doing Star Wars and Zelda just to get ready for Star Wars coming out this week and then Zelda coming out in three weeks <laughs> and Pokemon doing all that so I was like I need to relax play some Digimon then I played an hour of it and I was like I'm really liking this game I should stream it <laughs> fucking Christ as you play the game, you will need to travel to locations on your map to advance the story. You will slowly gain access to more locations by progressing through the game. Spider Lily Forest has been unlocked. Um, excited for Honkai Star... 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 What the fuck? Why am I having a hard time reading that? <laughs> Honkai Star Rail? That comes out tomorrow? I thought that was out already. That's the mobile game, right? That's the one that's like in a space station <laughs> or something? I don't know, man. Fucking... Ah... Uh, like... I'm pretty sure it's not gonna control, like, um... Like, uh, what you call it? Why am I forgetting the name of the damn anime Breath of the Wild shit? Uh, Genshin Impact. I'm pretty sure it's not gonna control, like, Genshin Impact. I know it's, like, the same devs or whatever. But, uh... I don't know, man. I Gotcha systems and shit like that. I can't do it. Oh man, speed them up, gotcha systems. Ah, uh, I fucking hate Persona now. Damn it. They got that Persona fucking, what, what is it? Persona 5X or whatever? I don't fucking know. They got that shit going on. It's like a gotcha game, but it's like an actual game. It's like an actual game on the phone in China right now. We'll probably get ported over because it's Persona. Why wouldn't they? But, like, it has, like, a whole story and everything and all that shit. Phantom X, thank you. Um, fucking... And then I'm like, oh, God, it's gonna be gotcha shit, isn't it? Gotcha shit with personas. Oh, Christ. And then I had a flashback to where it's like, there used to be a Shin Megami Tensei game that also had gotcha shit on the phone. And I was like, oh, fuck this. Fuck this. <laughs> yeah, Persona used to be sacred to me, damn it. And now, and now it's... This shit. It looks good too. And of course, like every other Persona game, it takes a lot of shit from Persona 2. Even the main character looks like a bootleg fucking Tetsuya. But, um. Damn it. I'm just looking at it. I'm like, I hate gotcha games. I hate mobile games. Fucking Christ. Why did they got it? Oh, Persona, why? <laughs> why? I just want to go back to Persona 2. That's a lie. I want to go back to Persona 3, which is might get a remake, which isn't that hard to believe because Persona 5 has a uh, literal character models and battle systems and <laughs> and stuff for Persona 3 and 4 in there. And then you got the dancing games or whatever. But, you know. Uh, play it just so you can give your raving review. Oh, God. I'm gonna play it too, but fuck, dude. I like. I'm looking at that gotcha. I really hope that game has an ending, though. It better have an ending. It better have an ending. I can't imagine. Like, I know it's a gotcha system game, and it probably won't have an ending. They'll probably be like, "Oh, here's another palace or whatever." But fuck, dude. I don't need that. I don't need that in my life. Switch over to uh, list views to see locations. Information on the bottom right screen. Also, pay attention to the icons displayed on the list. That, whatever the fuck that icon is, means there's some someone at the location. There's a character icon displayed in the bottom right corner. Okay. And then that one lets you know if there's a person to talk to to advance the plot. Other icons will show you where to find important clues or alert or alert you to where enemies are. Okay. So keep all of them in mind as you play through the game. Now, try selecting a location to advance the story. Sure. But I'm, I'm, what? Oh. I had to verify it. Hey, there's Kaito. Has he found anything? I don't think he found anything. If he found anything, I think he would tell us. Actually, yo, how you doing, girl? You still scared? You've been pale for a while now, girl. You gonna faint or something? <laughs> Fucking, I remember, uh, one time, back in, like, uh, high school or whatever, we went to, like, a trip to a farm. And... Fucking, this is why I keep checking on Yo, right? I want to make sure she don't fucking die or anything. Because, I'm, because you know, i never been the one to be like, ah, oh, people faint in movies and shit, that's not real. 
you know, it's whatever. And then uh, we went to a farm, and the homeboy was like, oh, a cow's giving birth, you want to see it? And for some reason, the teachers let us go, or whatever. And then uh, one of the girls that was with us, who, uh, she was in the group, because I guess she liked one of the guys in the group. Um, she's like, yeah, sure, whatever, she's tagging along with us. And then she sees the baby calf fucking coming out of the mom, like, all head first and fucking hooves first and shit. <laughs> and then she just faints on the spot, and I'm like, oh, fuck. <laughs> I'm like, oh man, I didn't, I didn't know that would happen. She okay? Did she hit her head? <laughs> Damn it! So I gotta keep checking on Eo. I gotta make sure it's not too much for her. I gotta make sure she don't faint. All right, you good girl? You've been, you've been looking pale for a while. Oh uh, well, if I'm being honest, it's taken a lot to deal with this place. You shouldn't push yourself if you're that scared. You know, girl, you can lean on me. What's up? Take my goggles. I'm the main character. I got goggles. <laughs> Thank you, but our friends might be facing something even scarier right now. Like, like a salesman. <laughs> like it's Spongebob. I think someone's trying to sell me something. And then there's two salesmen hiding behind a rock and they're like, I told you he was onto us. <laughs> Saki, Ryo, where are you? Just know all, our, all the OGs are coming back. <laughs> Whatever sales, sales are in the slumps. Jesus. All right, Kaito, who's obviously the mat standing. Hey, Mew, where are you? You know what? I also just realized he's got a little sister. Matt had a little brother. What was his little brother? TK? Oh, Takuma. Have those guys found anything over there? Nothing yet. Have you found Mew? I think you screaming her name at the top of your lungs is indicative that you didn't find her. Nope. Jeez, where the hell is she? Dead and buried. Damn, that got dark real quick. Shit. <laughs> Saki and Ryo are with her for sure. Hey, I'll join the search. Wait, what do you mean you'll join the search? I thought I was already joining the- wait, what? Was I half assed in this? That'd be a great help, thanks. Is that sarcasm? I don't know, am I getting gaslit? What's happening? That'd be a great help. <laughs> He's like, yeah, yeah, that'd be great, thanks. Um, okay. How do I... Guess I'm heading back to the shrine? Yup. Got vampire survivors a few weeks ago. <sighs> I hope you enjoy it. I know I wouldn't enjoy it. I like... Again, I don't like mobile games, right? And I, I, I surely don't like a game where I just kind of sit there and stare at the gameplay itself. Like, yeah, it's cool. You know, and it has all those, like, bells and whistles that that just scream to fucking gambler addicts, you know? Like, you wanna see- I love seeing big numbers go up, right? So I like seeing that, I mean, who doesn't like seeing that? But, um... I just wouldn't like Vampire Survivors, I know I wouldn't like it. I would just sit there and be like, what am I doing? What am I doing? I feel like I'm wasting my time. <laughs> but people like it. It seems like it's getting like a big update or something, or like it's changing engines or something like that soon. At least that's what I heard, so... You know. Also, isn't there just sprites directly ripped out of fucking Symphony of the Night in that game? <laughs> Funny things, apparently the devs of Versus made slot machines. Oh, okay. Why did I call it Versus? <laughs> I saw VS. <laughs> A vampire survivor. Okay. Yeah, 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 Fucking got all those lights and bells and whistles and sounds to make it addictive. And then all you gotta do is pay $2 for the DLC. Give me two dollars. And then a bunch of games are, well, a bunch of other weird indie devs, you know, trying to make their own version of it. I think there's like one called Hollow, is it, is it one for like Hollow Live or something? It's like VR tubers or some shit like that, but it, someone told me it doesn't work that well because it tries to be 3D and it fucks around with like all the CPU stuff and crap like that. I should check in with the others. Goddamn epilepsy inducing. <laughs> it's like the fucking Incredibles 2. That one scene that you're watching in the theater theaters with all the black and white, and you're like, oh my eyes! Who who thought this was a good idea? Is anyone in the theater having a seizure right now? Fuck. Alright. I guess I'm oh, guess I don't talk to you. Alright, shoot Shuji, what you got? Everyone's been ignoring you. I've been ignoring you. Don't spread out too far, everyone. Stay- Alright, you narc. Shuji does his best to keep us all together, so much so that he's barely even searching. 
You back here, Minoru. Listen to what I say. Narc ass. Yes, sir, I do apologize, your bluster shit. Why does nobody listen to me? Is it the glasses? Hey, Minoru, what you doing? No radio. You're just really, like, out of it, aren't you? Saki, Rio. Yeah, she's doing her best. She's doing her best. <laughs> Alright, give her some air. Uh, somebody's gotta put a warning on that shit. Exactly, dude. Fucking... Motherfuckers, like, I know there's like a, um... There's like a... It's like a program or like some type of coding or something. Somewhere where it will tell you the exact, like... The exact, um... Like what you what you have to avoid to exactly uh, avoid someone having like a seizure, I I forgot what it is, but like you know, you, it's like a program or something. You check it out and it's like okay, well you're making something. Avoid this specific like frames of color changes and stuff like that to avoid that. So you know it, it's it's very helpful, right? And it should be used, but most people don't use it for some reason. I don't know why. Um, it's never used, even though it's super helpful and really easy. And, uh, yeah, so when I see, like, things like, uh, when Cyberpunk came out and one of the reviewers is like, yeah, it triggered my fucking epilepsy and I had a seizure on the floor playing this game. It's like, how did you not, how did you not test this? Right? Fucking, and then there's some game, like, I'm photosensitive, I'm photosensitive, right? So light really bothers the fuck out of me. I mean, that's no surprise, because I thought my room is pitch black. I got blackout curtains, and my room is painted black, and everything's dark. And just like the rest of America, I got a vitamin D deficiency. But, um... <laughs> but, like... I'm out here skulking in the shadows. But, um... Like, I've always been photosensitive, even as a kid. So, fucking, it's like... It's like, guys, how do you not test this shit out? Come on. And then you got you got The Incredibles 2, which is like, look at a bunch of fucking kids in the theater and have them watch this scene where Elastigirl is surrounded in like this hypnosis room where it's just black and white going fucking everywhere, super intense. Like, that's a lot of eye strain. That shit hurts to watch. Like, god damn. Uh, let me see. When I played EDS 5, Earth Defense Force. The fact that I knew that off the top of my head, I feel, I feel weird. Um, all the bright flashing lights burn my eyes if I play long enough. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> when you play a game long enough and then, and then you're like, why do my eyes hurt? And then you check in the mirror and they're bloodshot. You're like, what did I do? <laughs> what did I do? Huh, what? what? What's in this picture? It's just a picture of Minaru, <laughs> Minaru taking a picture of his own balls. And he's like, hey, check this out. This is weird, right? And then you're like, come on, Minoru, what the hell? Yo, Takuma, you should take some pics over here too, man. Me? But why me? My phone's picking up some weird shit. Might be broken, so let's check it out on yours. You sure your finger isn't in the shot? My finger's not in the shot! Something like all the fuzzy in my pi- Wait, what? <laughs> Something's like all fuzzy in my picture. Go on, take some. Hmm, doesn't sound like he's messing around. Especially when he looks like he's about to fucking stab me over a goddamn photograph. As you play the game, you will sometimes be able to find clues using the camera on your phone. A camera icon will appear on the top left of the screen when this is the case. You can take out your camera at any time while you're exploring. Access the blah 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 with your camera. There you go. Your camera can sometimes reveal things that would otherwise be invisible. Okay. Let's check around, uh, let's check around Yo, since she's acting all weird. If you notice any distortions while using your camera, try focusing on it to investigate. This is a nice effect. I like this. When the fuck? When the fuck did you get back there? <laughs> what? Yeah, out there skulking in the background. Okay. Whoa, that was weird. The frames dropped in this visual novel for some reason. That caused my frames to drop. <laughs> like what the hell? Wait, then can you play a lot of Air Raider? What the fuck? What's Air Raider? Creepy ass Digimon stalking in the background. What the hell? Uh, nothing's here, but the camera definitely picked up something. Huh. 
What's this? What is it, Minato? Hey, you got. Hey, you guys! Like, it's the fucking Goonies? There's a weird thingy over here. You're just gonna walk off on your own? Weird thingy. Who knows what that could mean? It what? Don't just go off on your own! Uh, fine, we'll all go together. No one's paying attention to fucking Shuji. He's like, come on guys, I'm the leader. I'm the chaperone. The teacher's putting me in charge. You're supposed to listen to me. <laughs> what in the world? You okay, Kaito? You look like you uh seen a ghost. I'm trying to see a ghost right now. I'm gonna see some ghosts. Look, it's the size of this thing. What the fuck? Look at... Uh, God, stop saying that, Minaro. It's pissing me off. Look at the size of this thing. Whoa. Are these ruins? Hmm. Looks pretty O's. Look pre... I... Hmm. Alright. Looks pretty O's. Did I just say that? Fucking Christ. I can't read anymore. Narrator is... Uh, is the motherfucker in Earth Defense Force that gives you... Most epilepsy. What the hell, really? <laughs> He's got airstrikes for primary weapons. What is it, like a moth or something? Is that a fancy word for a moth? For a dragonfly? They're all bugs, right? Say, any ideas what this is? Not a clue. I've never heard of anything like this. It's like the shrine's uh, sacred prohibit. Wait, what? It's like the shrine's sacred prohibited space. That's a lot of words you just said. <laughs> I get it. I get it if no one talks about it. A couple of sacrifices being held back here. Or at least, I wouldn't be surprised about it. Don't tell me Mew went in there. Man, you really gotta keep a leash on your fucking sister if she's going all over this place, dude. She got out the house once. <laughs> you let her out the house once. <laughs> and this shit's happening? There's no way a girl would go in a place like this. You sure about that, yeah? Fucking sure about that? <laughs> That's where you're wrong. If it's, if it's her we're talking about, I guarantee she went inside. I bet Yusaki ran right in after her, huh? Like, ooh, this and ah, that. That does seem to fit her M.O. Mew? Come on, what did I just talk about? <laughs> Can't lose track of him. Let's split up and look, that's a great idea. Kaito, don't go alone, man. Harmony changed. Wait, Kaito, don't go off on your own. I just can't wait around here. What if something happens to Mew? Fucking Kaito, I'm just saying don't go off on your own. I'll go with you, damn it. Just chill out, alright? What are you doing your fucking weird ass rat tail? <laughs> Yeesh. Alright, I guess I have no choice. Let's go then. Aww. Doggy. <laughs> Doggy motes. Alright, see you. Nah, it's a playable class. Two, uh, two-third air raiders consist running bombers make- Wait, what? I'm reading that right? Uh, running bombers making the game borderline unplayable for the- <laughs> What about the frame rate? Does, this, does the frame rate keep up? Because I remember Earth Defense Force not having good frame rate. I'm like, uh, like, I played it a little bit once, and I was like, well, it was like, what? Earth Defense Force 4, I think I played it? Like, on the PS4 or something? I don't fucking know. Um, and I played it for a little bit, and I was like, oh, this is buggy as shit. <laughs> Literally, buggy as shit. Hey, Saki. Yoohoo, Ryo. If you hear us, please answer. Scary as shit out here. I'm definitely not gonna get murdered in here. Oh, there you are. What's up? You just ran off. Don't worry us up like that. Oh, sorry. What the? I don't believe it. Sacrifices. What the fuck? <laughs> what are these fucking paintings and shit? Some lady getting... That's a fire demon on that wall. Plus, look at this. A mural across the whole wall. This is really something else. Whoa, you're telling me. I feel like I can get swallowed up by it. Exactly. How do I explain it? There's just something divine about it. Wait, what? Are you okay, yo? Yo? Are you alright? 
<laughs> we got here and you're all like, I'm cold. I'm scared. I don't know what to do. I'm, I'm trying to hold it together. And then we get in this creepy ass place with the skull dragon literally right behind you. And then you're like, it's very divine in here. I have the answers now. God speaks to me. And then she just fucking murks all of us. Maybe it wasn't danger or retribution that caused people to close this area off. They might have been trying to protect this sacred place. Hey, now's no time for gawking. Or did you forget what we came here for? Are you okay, Kaito? I came here too and you looked all disappointed and shit. Now you're all angry. I'm telling you, Kaito, your sister's dead. She is gone. Right, right, sorry. Just got caught up in it all. He's right. We have better things to do right now. Alright, well, uh... Well, let's go find the others, then. I mean, that's what we're here for. Harmony change. How, how... I don't know what that means. And it scares me every time I see it. <laughs> Never had any problem with frame rate problems, but the but then again... you build P Oh, well, if you played it on PC, then, then yeah. I played it on console. <laughs> the one time I played it, I played it on console. Because I think it was like a free PlayStation Plus game or something like that. And I was like, man, this thing is barely holding up. Pretty sure if I played it on my PC right now, I would get like maybe, maybe a couple frame dips a little bit. I think a 3060 would be able to handle it, but I feel like a game like that would be CPU heavy. I mean, I wouldn't play the game regardless because I fucking hate spiders, so. <laughs> I fucking hate spiders. Yeah. Uh, we gotta go look for Saki and the others. Again, every time we're talking about the others, the first name we say is Saki, not Ryo. Not, n not one person has said, we gotta go look for Ryo and the others. Fuck Ryo, that guy's dead. Oh, now, nah, okay. Alright, way to prove me wrong, yo. Wait, alright. Huh? I hear footsteps by the entrance. Could it be the others? I'm sorry, did we just walk in here, find one room, and then started screaming to see if they're hiding in this one room? Is that what just happened? <laughs> Fucking... This one tiny room? Hmm. Are you... Who are you? Uh, hello there. God damn it, we're gonna die. We're gonna die. There's an old man in here. Oh, fuck. Your guess is as good as mine. What are you all doing here? Surely you know you can't be in here. This is where I keep all my dead bodies. Uh, well, you see... That's our line, man. What the hell are you doing here? Hmm. No, no need to worry about me. I'm just a friendly neighborhood murderer. My purpose here is far from nefarious. That's what makes me worry, is that you tell me not to worry. <laughs> I'm a researcher of the Kimonogami faith, passed down in this, re in this region. The shrine is connected to said faith. I just got permission to investigate it. Research? Investi Wait, isn't this the guy from the cutscene that, that got, like, murked? <laughs> what happened? Well, it's a good thing you kill the spiders, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. I'd rather not see the spider. I'd rather it just, you know what? If it's not there, I don't know it's there. You know, it's fine. If I don't know it's there, it's not there. It doesn't exist. <laughs> but once I see that motherfucker, I'm like, you ain't paying rent in this house. People are like, oh, catch the spider and let it outside. No, nope, kill that fucker. Dead. On sight. Researcher, investigate. Are you a scholar of some sort? Indeed. I study ancient Japanese history, researching it for a university nearby. Then that makes you a professor. <laughs> I've been shunned from the scientific society and forgot the last part. What the fuck? I didn't turn off notifications? Motherfucker's playing Destiny 2. So this place is valuable enough to be worth researching, huh? Well then. <laughs> that notification really got me. I'm like, what the hell? You think I like? Wait, what? Oh, have I ever heard of a game called? Hold up. I gotta look at it. Hold up. Su Suzerain? Su Suzerain? Suzerain? Mm -hmm. Suzerain? Is that the one that YouTube keeps like? Is it based off an anime? Is that the one that YouTube keeps fucking sending me ads? That's like, that's like. Oh, you should watch this anime. I don't know what that is. I'll be honest, it's been a while since I watched an anime. It's been a while, a long while. The last one I watched, uh... Off the top of my head, what is the last anime I watched? Fuck. 
I watched Jojo Part 6, but that's because I, I just needed to see it. I already knew, you know, I read, I, I read Jojo already, so I already knew what was going to happen. I just wanted to see how, how they were going to do it. But I'm pretty sure I watched something else after that, though. Pretty sure there's another anime I watched after that. But for some reason, I can't... I can't remember. Huh. Was it even a good anime? <laughs> was it even a good one? I can't even... Oh, damn. <laughs> now that... If I can't remember, was it good? Yikes. Well then, what has brought all of you to a place like this? Yes. Well, you see, sir. I'm gonna go look somewhere else. Alright, Kaito. Hey, Kaito! Now, now, Shuji. Let him do as he do. <laughs> I get why Kaito feels restless, but... I'm really curious about this place. I get why he's worried about his sister. She might be dead in the woods somewhere. Um... But I want to know more about these paintings on the wall. Uh, you play as a leader of the country, and you go through and basically mold the country to your uh, to your politics. What the fuck? Hmm. Maybe. I never I never played it or seen it, but maybe I might like it. Maybe. I do like I do like crunching numbers. <laughs> Number crunch. This shrine is pretty weird. Maybe I should talk to the professor or inspect the mural. Okay, how's everybody else holding up? Oh, I can't talk to them. Okay, we'll inspect the mural. The dragon coming from hell. The fire demon. Birds. Fucking some type of Godzilla. A, a goddess of some sort. God, it looks just like fucking Kaguya from Naruto, the worst thing ever created. God, um, let's forget Naruto's a thing, okay? Let's just... Professor? <laughs> what do you got to say to me? Have you all come here to study the Kinog uh, Kinogami as well? Yes, we're on a school trip. Wait, we're on a school trip? I thought we were on a... I thought we were... On... I thought we were doing summer camp. Not summer camp, spring camp, something camp. We're, we're camping for some reason. But we actually came here to look for some missing people. Our friends and that guy's sister. Yeah, he came to look for her. What? What the fuck was that? Minaru, what the hell? Why did you add that part in? <laughs> like, hey, we came here to look for for uh, some campers, and he's here to look for his sister. And then Minaru's like, yeah, he's here. To, they're here to look for them. I ain't got nothing to do with that. <laughs> like, what the fuck? Uh, speaking of anime, gotta watch. I'm not even gonna pretend to say that name. What's it about? <laughs> Fucking. I still gotta read the uh, the manga recommendations that you guys gave me back during the uh, Demon. Uh, not Demon. I was about to say Demon Slayer. Fuck. <laughs> back during the um, Demon Souls uh, streams. I haven't. Because what I was gonna do was I was gonna head to a manga shop that's like. Uh, at the city near me and I was gonna like see if they had it there and just buy it from there or whatever I could have called them in, but I should call them and just I do have some orders on wait over there but I just couldn't find any time to go there um and every time I go there I spend about like at least 300 bucks <laughs> fucking um and then you know I was like <sighs> I was like I'll read them online but then a bunch of other shit got in the way but I need to I need to get to doing that. I need to get back into anime in general, honestly. Fucking I've been Huh. I'm trying to think. Actually, you know what? No. I remember what I was thinking about earlier. It wasn't uh JoJo was the last anime I watched because it wasn't anime that I watched. I, I barely watch TV as is anymore. I'm just so busy all the damn time. Um and if I'm gonna spend time I usually play a game or something. But, uh, fucking, it was Wednesday. That's what I was thinking of. That's the, la that's the last TV show I watched was fucking Wednesday. And I mean, yeah, I like Wednesday, right? But I always liked the Adam family, so. <laughs> Remember their child, Pubert? 
<laughs> Nobody remembers Pubert. Uh, it's written by the author of, Ka of Kaguya-sama. Oh, fuck. Really? Drawn by Scum's Wish author. I don't know what Scum's Wish is. Oh, by the way, I have, uh, I have right behind me. I had this for, like, months. It's still in the wrapping and shit. Uh, the Flowers of Evil? <laughs> the manga shop owner, uh, I asked him for recommendations. He said, oh, read this. And... The way he described it to me was, uh, apparently, it's about a guy, a girl he likes, and a bully, in which, this is what he explained anyways, um, this was his synopsis of it, so I'm not sure if it's right or wrong or anything, um, but, basically, main character likes a girl, he talks to another girl about it, she helps him get the girl, but then after that happens, she becomes his bully because she like blackmails him and she's like all right so you like this girl but now you gotta do some freaky shit for me <laughs> fucking so i'll uh i gotta read this i really do because fucking i feel like it's gonna be a trip <laughs> i feel like it's gonna be a fucking trip uh it's absolute peak can't say too much or else you'll spoil the first episode all right Kaguya-sama's done now, right? Or is the manga still ongoing? Because I was also buying those as they came out. I got a couple of volumes over there. I fucking love Kaguya. It's great. I remember recommending it to people, and then, and then, you know. And then, uh, the Chica dance became like a little meme. And then after that, nobody ever talked about it again. Finished a while ago? Alright, cool. Cool. Just need to make sure. Because by the time, when I, when I, um... You know, I was reading Kaguya, and then around that time, that's when Komi started, right? Um, and I've been ignoring Komi. <laughs> I've been ignoring it, so I need to do that. And then uh, I stopped. I stopped reading My Hero. But at some point, I guess I'll continue because I have. I already have like a good number of volumes of My Hero, but I, I stopped because it because I don't like it no more. It's bad. Um. I stopped liking it before it was popular to stop liking it. <laughs> Deku, you can suddenly now use six different quirks. Oh, fuck this. I'm out of here. I wasted my time. No. <laughs> fuck. Uh, also, did you know that there's another series by Asuka? Hmm. Coming out this week. Oh, you know what I just what I just remembered? fucking jojo part nine started i haven't read part eight so i gotta i gotta do that fuck jojo lands is out uh, oh my god <laughs> i gotta do it i'm still on part seven fuck i'm i'm like i'm on the third act of part seven and i'm sitting there reading about the president <laughs> president of the united states oh jesus there's a lot of shit I gotta catch up with, but then there's also stuff I gotta edit, and then there's games I gotta play. I still didn't beat Resident Evil 4 Remake. Oh, Christ. Alright, in this, the Kinogami Shrine, I hope there hasn't been... Sp Wait, what? In this, the Kinogami Shrine... Oh, he is a... Qu okay. I hope he hasn't been spirited away. Spirited away? Yeah, there's a legend about the Kinogami passed down since ancient times. But it's more than a legend. The stories are true, you see. True, you say? You didn't have to repeat what he said. Indeed, it was once custom to offer up local children to the beast gods as said, what the fuck? Oh, your sister is dead, dog! <laughs> How awful. It was a desperate measure to ensure the harvest or perhaps to, invent, <laughs> to prevent disasters. Yet these children did not die. Supposedly, they were taken away <laughs> somewhere unharmed. So, how do you know that? If you never see them again, how do you know? So that's what you mean by spirited away. Yes, but the custom was lost to the ages, and this angered the ancient Kinogami. Over time, such abductions were no longer a ritual sacrifice, but a curse or retribution. So basically, they turned to Michael Jackson. <laughs> I had to. I had to. It was right there, low-hanging fruit. He's like, you're not going to sacrifice any children? towards me anymore all right neverland ranch it is fuck 
It's okay, little boy. It's okay if we get married. It's all right. People will say it's weird, but it's all right. <laughs> oh, man. First episode is an hour and a half. What the fuck? <sighs> Jesus, I love anime, but it's like... ah, uh, It's a time sink because, you know... You gotta pay attention when you watch anime. You can't absent mind. You can't absent mindedly do that shit. I mean, you can, but then what's the point? At that point, you might as well go stare at a fucking brick wall. Ah, uh, I'll try. I'll try. There's a lot of things I got in a backlog, and then there's plans I gotta make for Halloween too. Yeah, that's right. I gotta make Halloween plans. Big, 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 big thing I'm doing for Halloween. So, uh, there's shit that I gotta get through with that. Uh, I, I've, I've been so busy that I bought full body VR and I've only been able to play it a handful of times. My controllers have been on the charger for like four months now. They have not left that charger. My, my pulley system is still up. I'm looking at my fucking, my wires and shit. Ah, oh, damn it. A lot of stuff I gotta do. I swear my mom and my dad is the best first episode I ever watched. I don't know. Have you watched Wednesday? <laughs> did you know did you know that she choreographed that dance herself? Did you guys know that <laughs> that dance is so shitty? By the way, Jenna Ortega, like her. She's cool, right? She can't act for shit. She's cool in Wednesday because you don't have to act, but in Scream 6, oh my god, you're the worst. You're so bad. <laughs> Fucking Christ, she can't act. Good thing she's a pretty face, I guess. Many legends regarding such incidents have been passed down in this region. I place no faith in fairy tales, of course. There must be a scientific explanation. Some reason for the continuous disappearance since ancient times. I'm sure of it. I view this as a superstition or a mental block designed to escape from reality. He seems pretty worked up somehow. <laughs> Don't want to make a mad or he'll stab me. I know you came looking for your friends, but I'm glad you can see these legend ruin these legendary ruins. Uh, interest in historical origins is what. Well. Listen, I know you're here looking for your lost friends, but fuck those guys. Let's talk about history. <laughs> Let's talk about how your friends are about to become history. <laughs> I support it wholeheartedly. Mm. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Shuji's like, okay, guys, let's get going. Take a good look at this. Who knows? It may end up... By the way, I just realized this guy said he was fucking... He was... <laughs> that that they don't like him in the fucking... In the scholarship circles no more. He's been discredited. <laughs> so, uh... We're, we're essentially talking to a crazy man right now. Take a good look at this. Who knows? It may end up being of use to you all. Okay. What, the shrine? Oh, I thought that would be the shrine. What do you want me to look at? Oh. The wall? Uh huh, I see. That sure as fuck doesn't look ominous. Discovery of these, uh, discovery of these mineral minerals. What? What the fuck are you talking about? What? Discovery of these minerals have led to rapid development of this region. And what mineral? Wait, what? A sudden population boom would naturally increase the numbers of missing persons. Dwindling resources, depopulation, likely Leslie absconding in the night from such troubles. I suspect the recent landslides are a result of unchecked developments since the Showa era. Unraveling the issues piece by piece allows for a logical explanation of the legend. At least, that's what I think. Yes, learning from the past can help us in the present. Hey yo, why don't you just sit, on, sit in the corner over there? You Stop repeating what he's saying. All right, but a brief synopsis is that Broski is a o o what the fuck OBGYN? I don't even know what the fuck that is. What's that an anagram for? And gets reincarnated as the son of an idol he mega simps for. I don't know how to react to that. What? A cooch doctor. <laughs> Wait. 
<laughs> so like pap smears and shit. You sure this is a this is like a like an anime? Is this a hentai? Sounds like a fucking hentai to me. <laughs> what the fuck? No fucking way. What? That's hmm. It's peak. Yeah, it's peak. When you when you're reincarnated and you're like, I I technically I was in her. <laughs> Does that count for something? Oh man, it dethroned Full Metal Alchemist. Okay, mm, I mean, in that in this day and age, is that hard though? Did it dethrone One Piece? Of course, it dethroned One Piece. Nobody gives a fuck about Episode One of One Piece. Fucking. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, really? Ugh. All right, I'll give it a look. I'll give it a look. Wow, thank you so much, Professor. What a wonderful and unexpected lesson we've learned here today. Yeah, muchas gracias, Professor. Hey, now, show some respect. Yeah, I love how these two are just gaslighting him. They're like, guys, just say nice to the crazy man and let's fucking go look for our friends. He's talking about sacrifices and shit. We gotta go. Okay, do I check the other wall? I guess I was supposed to check this wall first. And then he talks about minerals. <laughs> so, these are all drawings of Kinogami. They come in all shapes and sizes, huh? Hey, what do you think uh why do you think there's so many Kinogami in the first place? Do you have a hunch, sir? Indeed, there are several possible explanations for all this. The unique terrain would explain the frequent incidents, weak footholds, steep slopes. Magnetic fields mess with sense of directions and overgrown in flora and fauna. Oh, like the red spider lilies then. I believe there's something in the mir in the minerals around here that makes people lose their way. <laughs> wait a minute. Did he wait? <laughs> Did he wait? Hold up. Did this man literally just fucking go? It's the minerals in the water. It's turning the frogs gay. Did he just do that to me? <laughs> It's the water fucking turning the frogs get <laughs> This man's crazy. Creatures of the Kinogami uh creatures. Creatures of the Kinogami faith may have been altered somehow by the substance <laughs> it's turning the frogs get. I see, that would make sense. Uh-huh. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Can we can we go now? Can we go look for our friends before they die? Uh, what's this wall? Is this writing or something? Hmm. Are these drawings or some kind of text? Yeah, something like that. There are all sorts of stuff on this crazy wall painting. I've never seen anything like it. Huh? Something's written here. Maybe I can read it. Nope, not a word of it. This is just conjecture based on my investigations, but I think it says Agumon. As my research progressed, I learned that each of the Kinogami gave their own, uh, had their own names. Is that so? So there must have been a bunch of those things running around. Huh? Yikes! The hell was that? Hey! It's Mew! You look like you've been tortured. What, what is it? Did something happen? Some weird creepy... Uh, some weird creep popped out of nowhere, so I took off. Oh no, I left Saki behind. <laughs> Fucking Christ. She said, fuck that bitch, I'm out of here. Oh man. Uh, If I read Kage-sama, you know how good it is. So is there mind is is it a lot of gaslighting and mind games? That's my favorite. <laughs> That's why I liked Kaguya. It was a lot of gaslighting and mind games. Nefarious ass motherfuckers in that in that goddamn series. That voice. 
Saki? It came from outside, near the shrine. Come on, let's go. Whoa, what's with the fog? Yeah, man. There wasn't nothing like this when we came here came earlier. If we go out if we go out in this now, we'll just be as lost as the others. What about Saki and that screen just now? Ah, stay away from me! Wait, what the hell is that? It's a gremlin! Don't feed it after dark. Is she being attacked by something? Just kick the little fucker and pun his ass. You mean like a pervert? Alright, Minara. Alright. Alright. Okay. That's enough internet for you. A pervert? On a mountain? Why is that so hard to believe? Maybe it's a boar or something. Yeah, I can, instead of staring at it, why don't you go help her? Oh, fuck that! <laughs> oh, hey! Whoa, was it just me or did something light up over there? We, we should head towards her voice. Are my eyes playing trick on me? I can barely see a thing around here. This fog is seriously weird, man. It bothers me too, but not as much as Saki screams. Yeah, you're right. Maybe we should help her. Hey, Saki, Ryo, are you okay? Wait, something's here. What is that? Some kind of statue? No, no, that thing's moving. What in the world? That's impossible. That sound again. So this weird thing was making it. Ugh, back off, you freak show. What the... what is that? Hey, what's going on? I heard a bunch of screaming back here. Mew! You were here the whole time? Wait, Kaido? Why are you here? Wait, Saki! We're coming out- <laughs> Wait, hold up. Wait, what's going on? A lot of things are happening at once. Is that you, yo? No, stay away. Alright, I want to point out, there's like fucking eight of us and like this one small little creature. Just get in a circle and start kicking its ass. Start kicking that little fucker on the ground. No, come here. <laughs> Saki's like, stay away, it's dangerous. And then Ryo's like, fuck that, help me. <laughs> that creepy thing's looking this way. Wait, what, what should we do? It's not like we can just leave them alone, right? Even if she tells us to. This weird statue-like creature sets its sight on the others. A creature? No. A monster. What are you waiting for? Get the hell over here already! <laughs> could this be one of the Kinogami? No. How could it be? Professor, he followed us from the shrine? Is that so hard to believe? Yeah, I mean, he was there too. What, what are you going to do? Sit there and ignore it? <laughs> we have to save those guys from this monster. I mean, we're doing a lot of fucking... Oh, get closer and talk? <laughs> Run while you can! <laughs> Fuck you guys! <laughs> sure, why not? Get closer to the fucker. Let's try talking to it. Yeah, okay. What is this, fucking talk no jutsu? Yeah, it just... It's gotta be some kid pulling the prank. Hey, you there. Again, there's like eight of you? And like an adult man there. Just get in a circle and start hitting that shit with sticks. <laughs> Die, motherfucker! Whoa, hold up, Shuji. How heavy would a kid have to be to leave footprints that deep? Alright, listen, I know you live in Japan, but there are such things as fat kids, alright? Footprints? Well, and to be fair, it is foggy and damp out here. I'm pretty sure you can leave footprints in mud pretty easily. Look out, Shuji. Oh, of course he goes for the narc first. Ah, oh, fuck. Why am I taking a hit for the narc? What the hell? It barely grazed me, and yet, what power? Are you alright? No, I'm not alright! I got hit for you! You bitch! I don't even like you! This is bad. Let's get out of here. How did I get hit if those two are closer to it than me? Okay, fuck you. Alright, fuck all of you. <laughs> They're just leaving. A creature we've never seen before is coming right at us. What do we do? What a crazy situation we gotten into. What the hell is happening here? Oh fuck, Yo, what's going on over there? Did she faint? Oh no, Yo fell down, and the rock monster's coming this way. 
Stay away from her, you. I can't let it hurt her. Oh, oh fuck. I'm getting bodied by a rock monster. That thing just sent me flying. Oh, jeez, man. What the fuck? Why am I getting beat on? I'm lucky I got away just a few scratches after a tackle like that. <laughs> uh. <laughs> not, a, not mind games, but it's definitely still psychological? Okay. Alright. Wait, so... I'm gonna regret axing this. The kid's horny on his mom? <laughs> Fuck. The others. Hey, you guys okay? Takuma, you alright? No, I'm not alright. Help me get the fuck out of here. I'm sorry, it's all my fault. Yeah, bitch, learn how to run. Everyone seems to be okay for now. The fog has covered the entire area. There's a red spider lily at my feet. So creepy. Guys, you there. Oh my god. Huh? Shuji out here getting body too? Oh, we're fucked. See, I told you guys to kill the damn thing while there's just one of them. Now look, now look, he's got his homies with him. When the hell did we get cornered? This is bad. It's getting close and close. It's getting close and close. It's getting closer and closer. Oh, uh, man, they're in for a world of hurt. Is there any way to make it break for it? What? I'm feeling kind of dizzy. Am I going numb? Or did I take a harder hit than I thought? It might be that fucking aortic rupture. Or is it... Huh? An earthquake? At a time like this? Holy crap. The shaking's getting worse. Is everybody okay? No, we're not okay. Be careful, everyone. Move without paying attention and you'll... Whoa! I'm fucked. <laughs> and then he died. Wh what is it, Shuji? Whoa! Whole Earth came in and now I'm being fucking killed. I'm getting got. It's very pure and cute. Ain't no fucking way it's very pure and cute. Get the hell out of here. Get the hell out of here. Pure and cute, my ass. I tried taking a step forward and the ground crumbled beneath me. I plunged into a gaping hole that seems to pull me in. Wow. That's very descriptive. <laughs> it's phrasing. I couldn't even tell what was happening to everyone else. Unchecked development, recent landslides, the professor's words are coming back to me. Where the fuck did the professor go? Did he just run for it? I was getting bodied out here by fucking Digimon.
That's the most fucking visual novel ass and visual novel opening I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> what the fuck? Are you ready for a story? Damn, dog. I got a fucking body. Hey, I got achievement. <laughs> wow. Damn. Am I safe? Am I below the shrine? Looks like I got caught up in a landslide or something. Oh, hey, everyone. Is everyone okay? No, they're all dead. Half of them landed on their necks. Ouch. My head is pounding. I can't see anyone. Looks like they aren't here. Maybe I should take a look around. I did like that music though. Liked it a lot. All I can do is look around for now. Okay. Deep forest. Anything else? Overgrown spider lilies. Okay. More forest and more forest. Uh, the ground collapsed all around here, but none of my friends are around. I should check out other places. Uh, they're not here. What a relief. That means they weren't caught up in the landslide. I should check out other places. I don't see anyone here. Maybe I can find a trace of them in a different area? Oh! I'm an idiot. Wait a minute. Oh wait, no. I did the right thing. Okay, I thought I had to open the map or something. I can hear those sounds from before. Is it the same stone monster? Oh, fuck. Oh no, they're coming this way. I gotta get the hell out of here. Can't take any more damage. I got like fucking three cracked ribs. That was some very visual novel ass music. It was, dude. I got fucking Corpse Party flashbacks. I still gotta play Corpse Party 2. Fuck. Why did I remind myself? We did. The only Corpse Party game we didn't do was, uh, what you call it? Uh, Sachiko's birthday bash or whatever, but that's not canon, so I, I didn't have to do that one. But like, oh, I gotta play the second one. <laughs> Damn it, that's the only one that's left to do. I did all the other ones on the channel before. Those are all on my YouTube channel if you want to check those out. Boop, boop, bang. Okay, I don't think they're following me. I made it back to the shrine somehow. I'm still hungry from earlier. That ice cream helped out a little bit, but... <coughs> but I still get the stomach growls. No one's here. Not a single person. Hey, Minaru! Yo! Yo, what's up? I gotta turn off those fucking notifications next time I do this. <laughs> Is anybody here? Mm, no response. Where the hell did they go? Oh, maybe I can get one of them on the phone. I'll call Minaru. No service here. Damn, my phone is useless. Damn it, technology! Whoa, why did it just sound like someone fled from a Pokemon battle? Did something just move? Ah, oh, man. Something's here. It's that rock monster again. The sound disappeared. Doesn't look like it's trying to jump me, whatever it is. It doesn't look like it's trying to take my shoes. Oh yeah? Well, I'ma jump at it. Get a fucking brick. I was get my ass kicked until I grab me a brick. I'll just jump right at it. Maybe I can beat whatever it is if, it take, if I take it by surprise. Ready, Ann? Yeah! Huh? It's gone. What in the world? Hey, some of the grass is moving over there. I can't see anything, but something's there, isn't it? Hmm, that reminds me of last time. Alright, take my phone out. Morale changed. Now I think about it, I remember Minaru saying something back then. Something about picking up weird stuff with his... Oh, that's right. He picked up presents with his phone camera. Why'd you say it like that? With his phone camera. <laughs> With his photographic phone. Smartphone. Why don't I take a picture? It will last longer. 
be, take a picture of my death. At least there'll be some evidence. Right? I'll give it a shot. Whoa. The hell was that? It was just a moment, but I definitely saw something. Man, this will help me see it. Still, I don't know what I'll do if something attacks me again. Hmm. Nothing coming, just sitting here. I'll look around with my phone. Alright. Oh, there's a lot. There's a lot going on, huh? Oh, shit. Okay. I will check this grass. Hmm, nothing here. Okay. Nothing here. Alright. Trying to see if I actually have to, like, find the thing, find the damn Digimon, or if I just have to interact with the spots. Oh, wait, no, I see you. Oh no! It's a fucked up Choji! <laughs> wait, what the hell is that? Some kind of creature. Doesn't seem like that rock thing from before. Hope it's a bit friendlier. What? Wait, where are you going? Oh, it's gone. Don't tell me it plans to attack me from the shadows. It fucking gets me in a headlock. I'll survey the other spots with my camera. Alright. I mean... I already... Wait. Yeah, I already checked both those spots. Do I just... Guess I just find it again then. found it! Thing from before. It's right over there, no doubt about it. What should I do? It doesn't look hostile. Okay, it keeps running from me. Man, did it vanish again? That thing's quick on its feet. A at least I think it has feet. <laughs> He's like, well, uh, uh. Okay. Oh my god, is that a monster that may or not be digital? Here's what I don't get about the story in this game so far. They're like, oh, Digimon are these ancient creatures that they used to, they used to, uh, worship or whatever. It's like, wait a minute. You telling me motherfucking cavemans out here had smartphones? <laughs> Samurai out here walking around like it's Shimigami Tensei, fucking Shimigami Tensei 4. Uh, here you go, Samurai. My name is Boros. Here's an app. I gotta finish, I gotta finish fucking Shin Megami Tensei f uh, 5. Damn. I forgot that I was playing that game. I just remembered that shit. Damn it. What made me stop playing that game? Oh, Xenoblade 3 came out. That's what made me stop playing. Ah, fuck! Xenoblade 3 DLC comes out this week. Fuck! It's out today! Ah, shit! There's too much shit coming out, man. Wow, it's closer now. Wow. I turned to Owen Wilson. Wow. Oh. Ah. Uh, what is that thing? Hey, that's my line. What the hell are you? It talks? Shoo. Back off. i never seen anything like this before. What the hell is it? Seriously. What's this thing's deal? I'm not a thing. I'm Coromon. I've been waiting for you, old buddy, old pal. Huh? Koromon. Sorry, but that pal talk rubs me the wrong way. The name's Takuma, okay? Anyways, just back off for a second, will you? Takuma, that's your name. Nice to meet you, Takuma. That doesn't answer my question. No, no, more importantly. What did you mean you were waiting for me? Yeah, for ages, like, such a long time, pal. Why? How? First of all, why? Second of all, how? <laughs> Remember, work is for nerds and food is optional. 
I don't know, man. I got a pretty sweet gig. Most of my time at my job, I just bring my Steam Deck and I, I hook it up and I play whatever the fuck I want. <coughs> now, if only I can get paid for streaming. <laughs> technically, I get paid for playing video games. Technically. I'm not supposed to, but technically. Well, that's easy. You see, uh... Hey, why was I... Why was I waiting? What's with this thing? It understands me, but I couldn't call it... I couldn't call this a conversation. Anyways, it doesn't seem to mean... It doesn't seem to mean any harm to me, I think. You look like... Uh, you, wait. Can't read. You took the words out of my mouth. At any rate, I see you're not human. That's what I am. A human. And a young one at that. You don't have to... You don't have to add... I'm such a young human. I hope nothing happens to me. And <laughs> buy yourself something nice. <laughs> fucking have like G. Thanks for the bit. Having fucking GTA flashbacks with Trevor. Why don't you go buy yourself something nice? Ooh, thank you. She looks at the money. This is seven dollars. I said something nice, not something expensive. <laughs> I was like, man, that's such a fucking player ass move. That's what I am, a human. And a young one at that. A young human? i never seen one of those before. Kinda weird looking, aren't you? Still, I'm glad I got my- I got to meet ya. Mm-hmm. I've been craving something, you see. I've been waiting forever and ever. Craving? What the hell does that mean? Anyways, you're the one for me. It's like I've been waiting for you forever. What the hell does that mean? I don't get it. Listen up, uh, Koromon, was it? Stop treating me like some kid, all right? What, what, you just said- mm. I'm a young human! Stop treating me like a kid, damn it. I'm already in junior high. What's junior high? Well, uh, it basically means I'm an adult. Uh, wait, <laughs> wait. I'm in I'm in middle school. I'm an adult, damn it. Maybe in Japan. Land of the horny. Land of the cases. <laughs> no, I'm not trying to catch any. Adults are smaller than I figured. But anyways, my point is I'm not a kid. Why not? You seem pretty childish to me. Sick burn, Coromon. Why else would you get upset over a little thing? Shut up! <laughs> I had enough. Back off already. Talk to the hand. Wait, Takuma! First things first, I gotta shake off this weird-ass critter somehow. I'll try and get away from the shrine. Man, every middle schooler thinks he's an adult. Dude, fucking, uh, I'm not gonna get into it, but kids these days, man, fucking... <laughs> uh... They're just... Dicks, disrespectful ass little kids, man. <laughs> like, that's all I can say right now. I'm not getting into it. But, dude. I'm just saying, if you're a parent, maybe, maybe you should actually pay attention to what your kid's looking at online just a little bit. It's not like when I was a kid where, like, we were all innocent and AIM was still a thing and everyone still hid their addresses and shit, alright? That's all I'm saying. You know... Especially the way YouTube is. Oh my god. Oh my god. Have you seen, like, YouTube for kids? I'm, I'm about to get into it anyways. Fucking. The other day, I saw one of my nephews. He's watching a video of some parent and their child doing a mukbang. And the child's, like, three, four years old. And the child's, like, severely overweight. And I'm like, this is, I'm like, this is what we do now? Really? What the fuck? <laughs> like... The parent didn't look that bad, right? But the parent and the child was doing a mukbang, and the child looked like it was about to fucking explode. But whatever. Do it for the clicks, am I right? Kill your child. Fucking Christ. Okay, I think I finally lost it. Still, what the heck was that thing? I've never seen anything like it. But the really weird thing is, I wasn't, I wasn't all that scared of it. I mean, it was so small, and it kind of talked like a kid. Plus, it was so buddy-buddy. Heck, the fact that it talked at all is weird enough on its own, right? 
Maybe I was sleepwalking or something. Hmm, maybe I should look around more. What? Something's moving in the grass. Ah, fuck. Holy, it's the rock monster. Fuck that. I can't believe one is here. Damn, I can't get away. It's too close. I think I need an adult. Hey, how long did it take us? Two and a half hours until we got into our first battle. Get the fuck out of here. What do you mean? Harmony changed. Get the fuck... Who cares? I couldn't fight that thing before. Well, we could have fought it if we ganged up on it, but now we can't. Fuck it, it's just me and I got bodied. I got like five broken ribs already. That thing isn't take, taking its eyes off me for a second. I can't run like this. Yeah, you can. Yeah, you can. I don't give a fuck if he sees you. Get your ass out of there. Still, it doesn't look all that fast. Okay, if I just bolt. Uh, it jumped at me. Ah, oh, fucking Christ, man. A son of a... Looks like I, it looks like he's gonna charge at me again. Run! Is that Coromon? This thing's got an axe to grind with you. Hurry up and get out of here. Ah, oh, jeez, my legs. I'll try and hold it off so you can get away. Here I go. Ah, oh, shit. Boy, you're weak. Like, super weak. Listen, I got like five broken bones, but like, damn, dog. You're the one that should be running. But I gotta protect you, Takuma. Jesus. I'm just watching murder now. Oh man, this is bad. Kuruma's in trouble if this keeps up. <laughs> if it keeps up, he's in trouble right now. He's nothing but face. <laughs> Kuruma's is fucking 100% face and is getting his ass kicked. Can't believe that tiny thing's risking its life to protect me. I know, I can't just run off on my own and let it fight to the death. But what? I gotta protect Koromon, damn it! He's my buddy! I won't let you! Not bad, Takuma. That, but that might not be a good idea. Go, Koromon. At least one of us should escape. I know I just met you, but it's whatever. No way, I can't just leave you behind, Takuma. Well, I guess that makes the two of us, then. I guess we'll go out in a fucking blaze of glory. Now that you mention it... <laughs> and a bit of a pinch, but you know what? I can't afford to laugh. What can I say? Suddenly I feel like I can do it. I'm gonna go for it! Huh? What are you saying? Just watch, Takuma. I told you I'd protect you, and I meant it. Koromon evolves into... Agumon! I'll be honest, I never liked Agumon's design. <laughs> oh yeah, I got an Agumon. I love Greymon and like Metal Greymon and all that shit, but Agumon, it's like... It's like skinny, fat dinosaur. <laughs> fucking with like a weird head. Like even for a T-Rex head, it just looks weird. And he's got like little ears on the side. Oh god, it's so weird. He got these long ass eyelashes. It's so like, why isn't Gabumon the flagship? I mean, Gabumon's kind of a flagship, but still, I prefer Gabumon. Gabumon's so cool. Alright. I gotta defeat Gatsumon. Each battle has its own win conditions and loss conditions. You can also change the difficulty of a battle. When you're in a fight, you, can just, uh, you can't just win. You may want to try changing, changing the difficulty. <laughs> Dollar Charizard looking ass. <laughs> Fucking albino, <laughs> albino Charmander. 
<laughs> uh, this is a crucial battle, so it would help to exercise some caution. Caution to the wind, baby. Defending is an important aspect of battle. End your turn without attacking or use an item to defend. Defending reduces the frontal attack damage. Act to yawn. Uh, <laughs> reduces the frontal attack damage by half. Attacks from the side or rear are ineffective. You tell me attacks from my backside is unaffected? Okay. Of course. <laughs> Try defending. <laughs> you can defend all you want, but the backside is free. Free game. Try defending in this situation. Choose in turn. Rock fist. Ow! Defending against the enemy skill reduces damage by half. Okay. Not only did this significantly lower the damage you took, it also wasted the opponent's SP. I can't speak. Wasted the opponent's SP. I still can't speak. Fuck. <coughs> Since the enemy attacked this turn, it can't defend. Make the most of the opportunity. Unleash a skill now that the enemy is defenseless. Choose the attack command, then select Pepper Breath from Pepper Breath. <laughs> Sounds like something my ex used to call me. Hey, uh. Pepper breath! Fuck him up, Agumon. Set that rock on fire. That makes sense. During battle, it's important to keep attacks and defense in mind when you take turns. And then I just... You know what? I'm running back here. Fuck you. You can't get me. In turn. I got the high ground, Anakin! Fuck! Fuck him up, Agumon. You got this. Yay! Murder! Victory. That's a lot of stats. <laughs> Christ. Movement type? Walk? Okay. Three squares. Vert move. One. Vert. I got Agumon on Vert. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Christ. Potency crystal. Okay. Incredible. It really beat that monster. And what's with this appearance? This is the same Koromon as before, right? As you explore and earn rewards and battles, you will obtain various items and equipment. Equipable items in peculiar, peculiar, in particular, eh, peculiar, peculiar, whatever, particular can improve your abilities and let you use skills. Looks like you found an equipable item. Let's try equipping it now. Press the options button in the menu. Boom. Item needs to be equipped from the status screen. Open up the status menu. Yes. This screen shows your team members' abilities and equipment plus their evolution level. Press X to see more detailed information on the monster. Use R1, L1 to change categories. Go to equipment. The pause button also has several other options, including save, load, settings, and to I should save my game. <laughs> I just thought about that. Fuck. Be sure to check out all these menus to really get the most out of the game. Okay. So change, potency. Looks like sparks. Does this affect attack power somehow? Plus one uh, physical attack, plus one special attack. All right, cool. And now that's there. All right. Training, evolution, ooh, look at that. Okay, resistance to fire, water's gonna fuck him up. He's got some wind resistance, and neutral to light, darkness, and ground, it seems, all around. He's a rookie, and yeah. <clears throat> Stat items, field guide, something, something, I didn't get to read it. Phew, I was able to win thanks to you, Takuma. You're the... You are a beast out there, Kuramon. I thought you were I thought you were crazy to fight that thing, but then you freaking took it out. Not Kuramon, silly. Right now, I'm Agumon. Uh, Agumon? I thought you said Kuramon. Yep, I was Kuramon before. Now I'm Agumon. Okay, I really don't get it, but anyways. You really see <laughs> There there's a political joke in there somewhere <laughs> that I'm not gonna say. <laughs> because that's how you get canceled. <laughs> you really saved my bacon back there. I owe you one. 
That goes double for me, Takuma. You got me out of a tight spot back there, and I can only evolve thanks to you. Thanks to me. But I didn't do anything. That's not true. I can't explain it, but when I'm with you, I feel as if the power is swelling up inside me. Thanks so much, Takuma. What do you mean? Is that what made you transform? Seriously, what the hell is going on here? Beats me. Right, makes sense. <laughs> He's like, yeah, that makes sense. I guess it's my fault for asking you in the first place. <laughs> You're too kind. What about what about that sound of like kindness? I was being facetious. 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 However the fuck you say that word. Man, everyone's gonna freak out when they see you. Everyone? Yeah, that's right. I gotta go look for them. Everyone? Who's that? Oh, I mean my friends. A weird chain of events brought us to the shrine, see? We all ended up together at one point, but a landslide separated us again. Is that right? If they aren't around here, then maybe they went back to the schoolyard. Well, first things first. I gotta make it back to the school building. But I got no idea where I am in these woods. The fog doesn't help, that's for sure. Hey, don't go into the fog, Takuma. The fog? Uh, I didn't really notice it before, but I think the fog got thicker. <laughs> it's thicker than a snicker. I'm not going because I want to. Even without it, I'm having trouble figuring out where I am. If we were attacked by that weird thing again, it won't end well for us. I wonder how likely another attack would be anyways. Hard to tell. Hey, Algamon. About the rock monster thing, is that a friend of yours or what? First, I, first thing I've ever seen. <clears throat> first time I've ever seen a thing like that. Is this the true nature of kin oh, fuck, kimonogami? <laughs> I hate saying that word so much. No, no it, no way. I've never been friends with someone who just bum rushed you like that. Oh, I didn't mean like a friend, friend. Just uh, oh, oh, because. Cause I'm a Digimon, we all are the same, huh? <laughs> Agumon just starts fucking <laughs> going on a rant. First of all, I never attack kids the way they do. Uh, uh, what? You'll never attack kids the way they do, so you don't deny the effect, uh, the fact that you attack kids. Agumon? I like that you're looking at me like that. All I'm asking is how you guys are connected, that's all. Wait, they? Don't tell me there's more of them out there. Oh yeah, there's like tons of them. Big ones, tough ones, ones that fly, fast ones, fuzzy ones, you name it. Of course, there are good ones and bad ones out there too. Tons and tons, you say? Damn, I got a headache coming on. There's tons of things like that out there? This is my first time hearing about this. And definitely my first time seeing it. There's a bunch of different types too. What's going on? Maybe something happened back at the shrine to the Kinogami. Like we accidentally broke some sort of seal on the place or something? That could have released those bizarre creatures into the world, right? That reminds me. Mew was talking about some retribution thing back there, wasn't she? No way. I thought that kid was just a weird ass. <laughs> weird ass kid. Fucking freak. She shows up and she's like, repent. Being as nigh. Still, it doesn't feel weird to be with this talking creature. It's almost as if I've known this little guy for a long time now. Did the fall do something to my head? <laughs> He's like, am I living in the fucking ashes unconscious theory? If if Pokemon's coming to an end and Ash is gone, does that mean he finally died in his coma? <laughs> You know, the theory that he got zapped by Pikachu and it put him in a coma, so every Pokemon is made up in his head? Wait a minute. If that's how he got in the coma, then where did Pikachu come from? Oh, wait a minute. That's a stupid theory. <laughs> <coughs> Man, I remember the first time I heard that theory. I'm like, I'm like, if, if he's getting chased by Spiro and zapped by Pikachu, and you're telling me Pokemon is just made up in his mind, then how- wait, what? <laughs> that makes no sense. Well, I was wondering what to do. This place shouldn't be that far from the shrine. I doubt that rock monster went up and beat everyone in our group back there. Maybe didn't beat everyone, maybe he just broke- broke someone's leg. <laughs> One of my friends might still be around here. Monster isn't right. That right- that rock guy, for example? He's got some on. I fucking need some water. Need some agua, damn it. 
I need some Aguamon. Streaming visual novels is hard. It doesn't number on your voice. Jesus fuck. Monster isn't right. That rock guy, for example, is Gatsumon. Oh. So, all of you have names. Got it. <laughs> that sounds so racist. <laughs> oh, so you, you things have names, huh? Wait, I swear I've heard a story like this before. Oh yeah, the professor mentioned the name back at the mural on the shrine. So these things really are Kinogami, aren't they? Now let's see, I think we should head back to the school for now. I want to look for my friends along the way. Would you mind helping me, Agumon? Yeah, I'm with you. Alright, let's go. Huh? Was that a scream I just heard? Yeah, it sounded like a human. I heard it come from over there. <laughs> Was that a scream? Agumon's like, yeah, totally, dude. <laughs> that voice. I swear it sounded like Minaru over by the shrine. Okay, let's go. How long have I been streaming for? Almost three hours. I reflexively started running when I heard Minaru's cry. At that point, I hadn't given much thought to the situation I found myself in, about the mysterious creature Agumon or the place that I've wandered into. Who knew things would turn out like this, an adventure with our lives on the line? I couldn't have imagined it back then if I tried. But I did try. Keyword, tried. Part 1... Complete? Does that mean part one is done, or does that mean we're doing part one? <laughs> Fuck. Oh man, oh man, oh man. Are you serious? Why the hell is that rock thing chasing me? Wait, Minaru, I can't breathe. Yo, I can't even run anymore. That thing's not gonna let up. We're in trouble if it catches us. We have to run, and fast. You saw what it could do, didn't you? You won't get off easy if that thing catches us. But I can't move. We should hide somewhere and wait for help. Hide where? The only place around here is the shrine. Where the rock monster is. In the small shrine, we can hide in there. Yeah, we can corner ourselves in that tiny fucking room. Come on, yo. Let's get a move on. Uh, Alright. Damn! Did she collapse? Oh wait, no. <laughs> oh no, that sound. It's here! Damn it, let's go. Bring it! Minaru, what are you doing? I'll deal with the jerk somehow, so you get going. No, it's too dangerous. Who knows, maybe I can handle this guy on my own. I'll be a hero. I'll be a hero! Plus Ultra! Start crying and pissing all over yourself like you're fucking Deku. No, don't do it! Don't do it, child! Your back can't take it! <laughs> it's not there. Stay away from those kids. I trust the dog. I trust the dog, the weird dog squirrel thing. I like it. Huh? There's more of them now? We shall allow further- wait, what? <laughs> we shan't allow further wrongdoing from you lout. Oh my fucking god, I'm gonna hate this guy, alright? I'm gonna hate reading his lines. I'll protect you for sure. Fret not. Fret not, for you two are now safe. My man showed up like All Might. <laughs> Don't- never fear, for I am here. I can't even with all this. Where are you going, Minaru? Don't run off on your own. Don't leave me behind. <laughs> he said, you're on your own. I'm gone. Uh, no one's here. Where are you, Minaru? That voice is definitely Minaru. But where the hell is he? No, stay away. Why do I? Why does it gotta be? <laughs> Why'd it have to be that thing again? <clears throat> I'm losing my voice, by the way. Hey, Minaru, answer me! Takuma, I can sense Gatsuma nearby. That rock thing from before? 
Way over there, in that direction. It's near the shrine. Okay, let's hurry over there, Agumon. Wait! I sense a whole bunch of those guys over there. Wait, ah, damn it. Even so, we can't leave Minaro to fend for himself. Got it! Leave it to me! Oh, don't worry, I'll just get hard-bodied, says Agumon. Shoo! Back off, dang it! Look over there, Minaro's being attacked by Gatsumon. What do we do, Takuma? I don't know, fucking fight it. You <laughs> wait and watch. We gotta get him, right? Harmony changed. Yeah, I still don't know what that means. It scares me every time I see it. It's more scary than Telltale's fucking They Will Remember That. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, Takuma. Of course, I can't just leave my friend to those things, and by me, I mean you. Go fight my battles for me. It's too dangerous to tackle something like that stony thing head on. Let's look for a right time to... Ah, shoot, another one just showed up. Fuck. <laughs> he said, don't worry, don't worry, we'll wait until the perfect time. Ah, fuck. <laughs> uh, you are... Are you okay, Minoru? That one saved him? Oh, I know him. That's Falcomon. Get your hands off my G-Diffuser, Fox! I'm not like the... He's not like the bad ones. Now do you believe me? I told you I wasn't your foe. Alright, alright. I'm sorry for doubting you. Just help me out. Understood. If you want my help, then my help is what you shall have. I love how Minoru just gave up. He's like, alright, I'm done. I'm done. Whatever. You guys do whatever the fuck you want. I'll die, I guess. I see. That one definitely looks like he's on our side. I told you. What does that mean? Talk about what does that mean? <laughs> you racist. He's not like the bad ones. All those Gatsumon out there. I promise to watch it. <laughs> You're going to sleep. All right, thanks for stopping by. I'll I'll check it out. I promise I'll check it out. All right, all right. I got it. Don't worry. I'll be streaming again and fucking. It's in the schedule, but like in what is it like two two nights from now? Right? It's in the schedule, but I'll check it by then. All right. Fucking hour long. First episode is hour long. Oh my god. All right. <laughs> Still, I don't think he's a match for Gatsumon. Can I join the fight, Takuma? Yeah, we can't just stand here and watch. I actually need to fucking end this stream anyways. But I didn't I didn't want to stop in the middle, right? In the middle of shit popping off. Start bat? <laughs> Start bat? Okay. Fogamon can't handle this alone. Support him with Agumon. Better be careful until Agumon arrives. Select and turn. Okay, defend. Move the blinking square grid. Yeah, okay. Gotcha. Get in there, Agumon. Enemy is in your attack area. Strike first with the skill. Use the attack command and select Pepper Breath from the skill. Okay. Whoa, looks like you got some help from a friend. In battle, your allies will sometimes come to your aid. This is called Battle Backup. They can back you up in three different ways. Team attack, encouragement, and support. Team attacks, follow-up attacks... On a shared enemy, you must both be adjacent to the foe. Wait, we must be adjacent to the foe? Not to each other? <laughs> An hour and 22 minutes, exactly? <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, that'll be, yeah, I'll, I'll probably end the stream before that. Hopefully before 20 minutes. Uh, I didn't even read that. What the fuck it say? Damn it. Something about encouragement? <laughs> Support is when you try an ally recovering a certain amount of health or SP. The likelihood of battle backup occurs depending on both distance and affinity. Backup effects uh, can give you edge in battle. Try to stick close to your allies. Your affinity will change based on your choices made in the story and can be crucial in battle. I guess encouragement just powers up my attack. <clears throat> I'm assuming that's what it is. There's just one enemy left, but its attributes give it an advantage, so this could be tough. Why not get some support from Takuma or the others for this? Choose the talk command. Okay. This will bring up a list of allies in the fight so you can choose who to talk to. You can also see which rally effects you get from each character providing different effects. Sometimes you can talk to an enemy, but it looks like this one uh, this one isn't having it. Maybe next time. Now to cheer on Agumon, select Agumon from the list. 
Wait. Okay. Let's go, Agumon! Yay! Takuma's words of encouragement have empowered up Agumon. Rally effects last for a set number of turns, but only one character can cheer per battle. Okay. Words of support from a trusted friend can make a huge difference, turning the tides in battle. Use them at just the right time and you'll be sure to take down even the mightiest of foes. Now that Agumon is all powered up, it's time to blow this enemy away. <laughs> now that Agumon's all fired up, it's time to blow the enemy. What? <laughs> you got this. Scratch smash. Oh, damn it. I thought I could, uh, you know. I thought he had, like, a ranged attack or something. Oh, it pushes him back. Oh, shit. Okay. I don't think I can reach it. Oh, no, I can't. Wait. No. Damn it, I can't. But I could if I, uh... Nope, even, even from that distance, I can't reach it, can I? Yeah, no. I'll just intern for now. You will in turn. Get him, Agumon. Yay, genocide! Victory. Bandages. Cool. A band-aid is the name of the brand. The actual item is called an adhesive an adhesive strip. That's a fun fact for you. And by fun, I mean boring. I just felt like sharing it. Oh man, you really saved my bacon, Takuma. This guy just showed up, so I freaked out and booked it. Then that mini golem showed up. I tried to warn you about the Gatsumon, but you ran for me instead. Come on, man. I already said it was my bad. Wow, Minara's already getting along so well with them. We became buds in no time, too. Right, Takuma? I wouldn't call it no time. Okay, real talk, though, Takuma? What the hell are these things? That's what I want to know. They're on our side, though. That's, that's, uh, that's much. That much is for sure. I couldn't read. Yeah, on your side. You saw it yourself, didn't you? How they protected us? Well, yeah, I sure did. I believe I spoke to that several times already. <laughs> I know it's, I know it's, uh, <clears throat> I gotta clear my fucking throat. I know it's that we're being attacked by, all I know is that we're being attacked by these strange creatures in this weird forest. Hell, I'm just relieved to find someone else. Come on, let's look for Yo and the others. Yeah. Is something wrong, Minaru? Well, uh, um, uh, I was with the Yo before, but then Falcomon spooked me and I just... I, I took off at full speed, and I left her behind. You left her behind? I freaked out, man. I'm sorry. Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again. <laughs> Which way is she? Must be other monsters out there. Not many, but I do sense a number of them. Ah, oh, we gotta go look for her now. She isn't around here. We should go look somewhere else. Yeah, let's go. Huh? That voice. It's coming closer from the direction of the shrine. Could it be? Is it Yo? Hey! Oh, thank goodness. There you are, Minaru. And Takuma, too. Yo, it's you! It's good to see you're safe. It would seem we found who we're looking for. Yeah, that's right. Oh, where did you run off to, Minaru? I was worried sick about you. Yeah, about that. I'm sorry, man. 
I won't look so lame in front of you again. I'll run it. I'll run. I'll run in all the heroic and save the day. All right. Right back to the hero talk. Just don't give me a reason to worry again. Minara was relieved to see Yo safe and sound. He's back to his his wisecracking self. To be honest, I'm happy that Yo seems more annoyed than angry. Sorry, isn't gonna cut it. How dare you run off and leave a lady behind like that? Do you, do you think you'll get off that easily? Wow, what's this furry little squirt? Another one of them? Wait, this one seems... Now hold steady, you two. Don't worry. This one is nothing to fear. You sure? It looks like it's ready to take a chunk out of my ass. Who bite your scrawny ass? <laughs> Who bite your stinky ass anyways? Fucking Digimon just told him to go wash his ass. This sweet little puppy saved me when one of those things were getting ready to pounce. Yeah, I'm gonna protect you. That thing's more of a monster than a mutt. <laughs> uh, you you ever see a talking dog? Seems like something you should at least be a little curious about, yo. Don't worry. Lab Labra... Uh... Labramon, okay. Labramon's a good girl. I've known her forever. Yikes. Is that a baby dinosaur? I'm Agumon. Nice to meet you. And I'm Falcomon. Pleased to make your acquaintance. Nice to meet you. And your name is Labramon, right? Yep, that's right, yo. Good to meet you. Oh no, you've been injured. Yo, Yo tuck her handkerchief around Labramon. Wait, what? Oh, tuck. Tied her handkerchief around Labramon. Look how close they are. A stark contract from Minaru's panic before, and here I thought he was always keeping his cool. Alright. So how you holding up, yo? I know Minaru's doing fine, but how you holding up, girl? Hey, yo. What happened to you after we got separated? When the other beasts attack, the puppy Labramon, I mean... Wait, the puppy? Labramon, I mean. She saved me. That's how I got hurt. Oh, that's how she got hurt. Hey, it's okay. A scratch like this is nothing to me. You worry too much, yo. It's not nothing. You have to take care of you. That means a first aid kit. Right, a first aid kit. That means we have to head back to school. Now that I have an idea, where are we? Wait, what? I didn't read that right. What do you say? <laughs> Not that I have any idea where we are. The fact that the shrine is nearby means the school must be within walking distance. Let's try to head back before the sun sets. Hey, are you sure this place was here before? The terrain looks totally different to me. Really? You think so? I don't see the tunnel we entered in before, do you? And this ain't what I heard the place would be like before camp. Wait, what? The place would be like before. Wait, what? And this ain't what I heard the place would be like before. I did read that right. <laughs> Not even close. That doesn't sound good. Shoot. I doubt we can make it back to the school building if that's the case. Hey, Agumon. And you, Falcomon. Do you know this area well? We sure do. Ask anything you like to know. How do we get back to the school building? School building? It's like a two-story building made of wood. Humans spend time there. Oh, I've seen something like that. Really? Yeah, it's got a big old wooden building and a wide open space. The schoolyard. It's gotta be it. Where'd you see it? Uh, where was it again? Agumon. I do believe I know the location. I shall be your guide. Thanks. I'll leave it to you. Oh, it's finally coming to view. Yes, quite. Seems our conjecture was correct. Woohoo! Not much longer now. How's your leg, Labramon? Thanks, I'm okay, I swear. Looks like we made it back. I better hurry up before the sun sets. You know, I don't get it. Get what, yo? I tried my phone several times while we were on the move, but there's no service in the area. No phone service, no data. Not even this close to the school building. You're right. GPS, maps, heck, even my compass app won't work. Same here. Thing's basically a glorified camera now. And hey, did you realize we didn't pass through the tunnel to get back here? 
You're right. I didn't think it was on the GP. I didn't. Wow, I couldn't read. <laughs> I didn't think of it when the GPS was out. But did we take a different path? But that makes it even weirder. The path wasn't that complicated, was it? Hmm, I see you're confused, but I assure you there's no other buildings in the area. Come on, let's go. I want to go. I admit it's weird, but at least we're here. Send it to the school building. Great. We made it back before sunset. This is your school, Takuma? Not exactly. I go to a different school. This is just the one that we're staying in for camp. Still, I guess a school is a school. But what is a school, Takuma? Oh, it's, uh, what is a school anyways? I never really thought about it. I'm not sure how to answer. Maybe with something, maybe something a teacher would say. No, I should save my real <laughs> I should save my real feelings. Ah, but now's not the time for this. Hmm. Answer vaguely. Focus on first aid. <laughs> Fucking just just look at him and be like, yeah, school. Uh I'll answer it directly. We go there to study, go to class, take tests, the whole shebang. Class? Test? Shebang? <laughs> shebang! I think I'm too young for this, Takuma. What the hell is all that? Ah, uh, yes, I'll give you the rundown uh, on all of it later, okay? Right now, we better take care of Labramon. Let's head inside. Wait. No one's here. And what? And that's not even the weirdest part. Would you just look at this place? All overgrown and dilapidated. Yeah, why is everything so messed up? You think a huge earthquake tore through this place while we were passed out? Oh, you passed out too? Yeah, yo too, but... What in the world? What could have happened here? That's what I want to know. What's the deal with this place? It's gonna get dark soon, right? School building at night would be freak... Uh, would be freaky by itself. But all beat up and shit? Stop it, you're scaring me. Calm down, Minaru. Worry not. I'm here with you. Yeah, I'll protect you. I wonder how long we were out. It could have been more than an hour for me. That sounds about the same as us, I think. According to my phone's clock, that seems about right. The date hasn't changed either. Even if it can't connect to the network, the time should still be right. There's something... Uh, then something must have happened in that short amount of time, right? A weapon of mass destruction, a natural disaster, something like that. Then how come this place is so overgrown? Good point. This doesn't look like it was destroyed, more like it just fell apart over time. I admit, I am curious, but Labramon's womb takes higher priority now. Anyways, let's go inside. I'm trying to find a stopping point. <laughs> trying to end it, right? I'm trying to end the... Uh... The, uh, the part. The stream. Yuck. I thought it looked bad on the outside. Try not to fall through the floor, okay? Yeah, I can see that happening. Everybody watch your step. Labramon, what is it? You alright? Oh, damn. Does it hurt? Hang in there. Labramon, you alright? Labramon fell down, wincing. It looks like she was putting up with all the pain this time. I'll go look for first aid, kid. I, I, uh, I lost my I lost my way of speaking. <laughs> Again. I'll go look for the first aid kit. I bet there's one in the nurse's office. Let's we'll start on the first floor. Oh my god, I thought we were going to do exploration mode. <laughs> There's a first aid kit. That was easy. But of course the nurse's office would have one. I better bring the first aid kit back to Labramon as soon as I can. Hold on, Labramon. We'll fix you up. Hey, you two. Something's not right. I decided to check the first aid kit, you see? With the school all messed up like this, I wonder if the medicine's even still good. 
The thing is, the bandage still look clean, and the disaffected seem okay. It all looks brand new to me. Something isn't right, but at least we can use it. Okay, how's this, Labramon? Wow, this is perfect! Just a little band-aid and some disaffected, and suddenly my broken leg is healed. Labramon happily wagging her tail. She's basically Yo's pet pooch now. Uh, I don't get it. For a second there, I thought we traveled through time or something. We didn't get in. We didn't get in a time machine, and this first aid kit looks brand spanking new. Okay, the building itself is withered to hell. That makes no sense. I don't understand. Hopefully, we'll run into someone else around here. Hey, Takuma, this is like some kind of bad dream, you know? Sure, I feel the same way, but we can't say if it's a dream or not unless we wake up. Yeah, even if it hurts to pinch your cheek, it might still be a dream. But then the school's all messed up, and we got these strange creatures. What in the world happened there? Do you guys know anything, Agumon? I don't know what you mean. It's always been like this around here. Always? What the hell are you talking about? Yeah, but it is an Aguma. <laughs> it is as Aguma say. This area has been like this forever, from the moment we were all born into this world. We cannot grasp but what you find dubious about this at all. Forever, he says. But that's impossible. The school looked normal before. Isn't this the same school building? If not, then what is this place? What's going on? What? Please, yo, cheer up. I'm sorry, Takuma. Huh? What? Was that Ryo's voice? He's here too? I'm pretty sure that came from the second floor. Okay, it's hero time. Minaru? I won't run away this time. I'm gonna go and save Ryo. Good. Then allow me to offer my assistance. Let's go, yo. I'll keep you sitting. Wait, I said. <laughs> Ryo. Yo. These names. <laughs> Thank you, Labramon. But don't push yourself too hard. We only just finished treating you. I'm a little uneasy with all these things up in the air, but let's save it for later. If I focus on what's in front of me, I can keep my mind off, off of it for a while. Let's go, Takuma. I'm gonna save it here. Uh, settings. No, not settings, my bad. Data. I'm gonna save it here. I'm hoping that they'll give us a, a, a break. Like a little break area before we go up there. Nope, alright. We're just going into it. Okay. Well, now is a great stopping point, because I'm looking at the time. Uh, well, it's not really a great stopping point, but it's my stopping point, because I'm looking at the time, and I am running low on it. So, this is going to be it for the stream, right? I'm having a lot of fun with this. I'm having a lot of fun with this. I, like, I knew I was going to have a fun time with this. I'm having way more fun than I thought. So much fun that... I kind of hate that now that I'm streaming it, I won't get to play it <laughs> until like the next stream, which uh, it's up on the it's up on the Twitch schedule now. I believe it is Friday night, 11 p.m. Right, um, over there on a uh, uh, Pacific Standard Time. Uh, what is it? Uh, PST, right? And on the East Coast over here, EST, that would be two o'clock in the morning, because that's that's when I'm that's when I'm doing this, two o'clock in the morning. Uh, so yeah, you know, Friday, right? Um, what else is there I want to say? Oh, but uh, if you want to check out some other stuff, right, over on the uh, right there below the screen and stuff, there's my, you know, you see my Twitch, my Twitter, and my uh youtube and you can go check out youtube because right now i'm doing star wars uh fallen order getting ready for um jedi survivors to come out next week next week right this week next week this week this week i think it's this week it comes out um so be doing that when that comes out so i'm doing jedi fallen order right now over there on youtube 
along with uh, today should be the first part of Breath of the Wild going up, right? Because uh, Tears of the Kingdom comes out in like three weeks, so we should be able to get that done. And then uh, there's also Pokemon Crystal going up as well, you know? To find finally making good do on that Pokemon Marathon, right? And that's pretty much what's happening right now. Uh, if there's anything else, right? For those watching this on YouTube, thank you very much. I hope you're enjoying it, right? If you like what you see, leave a like, comment, subscribe, you know, all that stuff. Um, and, uh, yeah, click the notification and stuff like that. And for people on Twitch, too, if you're watching the VODs here, uh, please click the notification so you get notified whenever I go live. Um... I think that's everything I need to say. I don't think there's really anything else. Uh, yeah. Besides the fact that uh, I'm going to try, you know, I'm going to get back to streaming regularly again, right? Uh, had to, like, stop for a bit because, um, had to stop for a bit because my whole working schedule changed. And then that really fucked with a lot of things. And then after that, I did the, uh, I was doing the Jack, I was doing the Jack 2 playthrough, I was streaming Jack 2, but I think I'll just continue that on YouTube, rather than doing it on Twitch, and then, um, whatchamacallit, uh, came back and we did a Borderlands co-op on Twitch, because, uh, you know, because getting back to streaming and stuff like that, and that took a while, because we had to, you know, had to work out scheduling and stuff like that, and I didn't want to do a playthrough in between that as well. So, yeah. <clears throat> so, for now, we're just doing Digimon Survive, right? That's pretty much what we're doing until we beat the game, and then after that, I'll see what we got planned up. Hopefully, uh, this game will probably be long, but hopefully not too long, maybe like eight streams. I think we can do it in eight streams, probably, maybe. Maybe, I don't know. I don't know how long this game is. <laughs> but, um... Yeah, that's everything. <laughs> that's my outro. So, as always, fucking, first of all, I gotta make sure I have the thing up for me so I can actually move my mouse outside of the game screen. Yeah, but as always, I wanna say thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Stay happy, stay healthy, and take care. <laughs>